Oh, hello? Does anyone remember where we're at? <laughs> hello! Hi! Wait, I'm actually, I want to switch over so I can yap for a little bit. I don't care. Hello! Hi! Hi, popcorn! Um... Okay, I can just turn on the game audio, I guess, as BGM. It's like some sort of no-budget BGM. Hi, how are you? Hi, Flash, how are you? We got friend of me time for the dolls. Oh, yes! Oh my gosh. Hello, thank you. My throat hurts so much for chickens. Ooh, wait, that sounds so good. I, uh, okay, and okay. Let's, okay, last week, okay, I'm so sorry that I have not been here for a very long time. Um, last week we had that eclipse and I felt like, and I was joking around people, I was like, oh my god, that eclipse, wait, my chat box looks so bad. <laughs> wait, okay, let's yap while I fix this. How is everyone? Hi, hello, any news? Well, I've been dead for a while, low key, I've been losing my mind. Wait, can I talk about school for, hi Tyler, hello. Guys, what's your favorite your turn to die character? Mine is, um, Jin and Keiji because he's a hot man. And then I really liked that one guy that looked like the taxi guy. Hold on, I'm changing my chat box. It looks fugly. How is everyone? What's going on? What's going on? I'm gonna talk about school. Um, I'm like low-key losing my mind in a bad way, not even in a good way. I know, last stream was crazy. I wish it didn't rain. Okay, I'm gonna fix this Well, I uh, yeah. Yeah. Jin Kyutaro. Hi, Brian. Hello. How have you been? I'm alive. I feel dead inside, but I'm alive. Mr. Police is a good runner-up. Kyutaro is growing on you, though? No, real, though. What's, why does it look like this? Kyutaro is like... Chat box. Here we go. So it's still slowly growing, but I still hate him. I hate him, too. I hate his guts. Wait, let me change this. I don't know what font I had. It's this font. It's so fugly. I'm glad you've been doing well. I've been doing okay. I've been doing okay. Let me try to figure out what this font is. Hold on, let me look real quick. Anyone got any, like, normal font letters? Hello, Prince of Hisui Gyotaro. Let's all hit so together. Real and true. What does this look like? Why this font is so ugly? Someone's dying today? Maybe me. Is this, is this, is this, is this the font? I can't tell. My eyes hurt. Okay, hold on. Hello? Oh, that's an ugly font. I didn't realize this font is so fuggo and I don't remember which one I had to begin with. <gasps> okay, what about this one? Okay, it'll, it'll reset. I'm looking. This one's okay. Hold on. Font weight. Let's make it bigger. Wanna place bet on who dies? I don't remember who's even alive right now. Oh, okay, there we go. What about this? How's this? I resetted it. I'm slow. Slowly? <gasps> it's a fucking maru. Why? Comic Sans font. Can you imagine? I feel everyone's eyes would like blur out trying to like, um, trying to fix this. I love how I was like, can I talk about school? And all I said was I'm losing my mind. And then we just moved up. Die. I missed. No, <gasps> die. Wait, I'll keep missing. You think I have a great- you have a- oh, why really? I listen to my voice. So, I don't know if y'all know, but I never ever rewatch my VODs because I can't stand to hear the sound of my voice inside my own skull. I don't know. I'll just keep this one. It looks okay. I don't know why it's not showing up on stream though. Okay, sorry. I'm almost done. We'll get to it. How do I refresh? Refresh. Okay. So... Where are we? I don't know. Oh, <gasps> yay, it fixed itself. It's okay. It's okay. Pretty much the voice of one of the MCs in teen horror film. Can you imagine? Do you have any socials? Yes, I do. Um, it's just my name. <laughs> Please follow me on Twitter. I hit 300, finally, even though I never post on it. It's just my name. Okay, here, let me link it. HTPS forward. Is that a bug? <gasps> I killed it. It was a mosquito. Oh my god. Okay. HTTPS forward slash slash forward slash slash Twitter dot two T's Twitter dot com. <gasps> you want to know something good though? Did I tell y'all? 
I had a like a research presentation. Oh, what? there you go. I had like a research presentation to give. Guess who won? Guess who won her poster presentation? It was me. Well, in, in my group, but I designed um, the poster and I designed the PowerPoint and I came up with the research topic. So I kind of did everything, but yay. Hola, Jeroshi, como estas? Muy bien. Y tu, y tu. I hate the sound of my own voice too. You love, thank you. My toy. <laughs> well, let's get started. I forgot about this guy. Midori, so to say. <gasps> thank you. I know they couldn't have done it without me. So, but then last night we presented our PowerPoints in front of like dentists in the area. Um, I hope I win, because if I don't, I will lose my mind. I just kind of like did too much, you know? And for what? You know what I mean? Okay, why? But I hate every green haired character. Wait, really? Even, um, um, Midorima Shintaro from Crocono Basket? Even him? Okay, what are we doing here? Saba's Espanol, oh no, um, was, um, Hablo espanol un poquito. Un poquito. Muy, muy poquito. Oof. Thank you. I really let the group. Whatever. If they heard, if they heard me say this, they'd be like, okay. <laughs> Midori Gurin. Mianism is one my... <gasps> Wait, before we continue, has anyone heard of Alien Stage? Because in my little break, this past week, I finally caught up with Alien Stage things, and, um, yeah. Yeah. I f I'm crazy. I I'm crazy. That's just it. That's just it. Okay. Something you want to say? Yeah, I remembered. You have not? Okay, so too long didn't read. Alien Stage is about how these aliens kidnapped humans this is my very bad explanation of it kidnapped humans and then make them perform and then the top performer gets to live and the loser gets shot and gets killed that's it but there's doomed yuri and doomed yaoi thank you i met you before ain't that right this photo you took it didn't you oh i remember now he took a stalker photo of reiko eating like lunch or something no probing, just shooting. Yes, the aliens shoot us. Aliens shoot us. In winter takes all, all alien American Idol. Can you imagine? The Simon Cowell of aliens. Ah, so you remembered. And it wasn't just once. We must have met a bunch of times. Before Alice's incident and... After it too. When you should have been dead. Huh. Strange things do happen. Back then, you made a request of me. What kind of request? Uh, I can't remember that yet. But still, that part doesn't matter. You set Alice up, you bastard. You made this shitty murder case and pinned the crime on Alice. It's okay, I love Doom slash Toxic Yaoi, but when the trope is when the others love slowly die. <gasps> yes, I... Sadly, I love winning and happiness. Oh my god, speaking of winning and happiness, there is a this new shoujo anime, a condition called Love. Two episodes currently out. Chef's Kiss. Love. So good. Okay. Oh, you get him. Go get him. <gasps> Great, a battle. Wait, I just JK. I'll show you my special move. Wait, I was just kidding. The slowly dying lover one's too much. You know, literally same. But I'll read and watch anything that is romance. Eh? <gasps> I'll close my eyes and I felt that. I felt him sm like punching me in the face. Something pierced the wall with a loud sound. Whoa, what was that? A rocket punch. Where's his hand? Cool, isn't it? He's mocking us. What if he got hit by something like that? Hmm, Miss Reiko. You're saying that I fabricated my own death. Well then, what am I? Uh, I mean, 
Haha. <laughs> Midori took the hand out of the wall. Just so we're clear, Miss Renko, I am deeply angry. Even I didn't plan for such an incident. It made me lose my seat in the death game that I was looking so forward to. I hope to kill Alice for that by my own hand. Oh my god, you bastard. Wait, so... Oh, they're still talking. And also, you haven't properly remembered everything yet. That lantern, it'll reveal the truth for you. My lantern. Go try it out. Not just on Miss Reiko, but on everyone. <gasps> Yay! Couldn't get a word in. Okay, that's fine. Still, I definitely think seaweed head frame stripey, meow. Yeah, you're right. Alice was a weak person, nicer than anyone. Thinking about it now, it all makes sense if it was all that guy's fault. I should have <laughs> believed in my bro. Rico was trying to accept Alice's crime. She tried to convince herself that it was Alice's fault. That must have been painful. I forgot about Jin. I love Jin. Jin is my favorite. If he dies, then I... Okay, if I accidentally do something and I kill him, then that is the end of the Your Turn to Die games. 100%. Because it's, it's just over. It's just so over. Hey, Sarah Senpai. Should we split up and look for clues now? We don't have many people. Let's do what we can. You know what? She's so creepy, but I don't think she could kill me. She looks like she weighs five pounds. Okay, let's go. Why did that make that noise? Sounds good. Be cautious, everyone. Be sure to put your safety first. And now I'm by myself. Why am I by myself? I should look for a way to go downstairs. Okay. Where am I? Oh, classroom. Downstairs? Isn't Hazel... Not Hazel. What's her name? Maple. Isn't Maple running around downstairs? You're not going to remember this. <laughs> She's so creepy. Look at her. I see. Seems to be carefully looking over the area around... Who's calling me? Oh, I can't pick up. Let me text her real quick. Where... Where are my messages? Oh, there we are. Okay. Maple's going on... Yeah, Maple's going on a rampage. I don't know what they're doing. <gasps> Let's use lantern. Take a look. Take a look at this lantern, Hinako. Ooh. What? I don't have that kind of time. Oh. So I can't just wave it? <gasps> Dang it. Okay, let's just talk to her. Noticed anything, Hinako? You know, Sarah Senpai. You think the breaker was shut off? Oh, and then Keiji is currently in that coffin. Dying. The breaker for the elevator was on floor four. You mean... M M M M Mabel? D did Mabel? Can't imagine that lady would be capable of that kind of judgment on her rampage. Maybe Mai? Or Kyutaro? Surely not Keiji. Ha ha, she is so unnerving. Like, that's what she actually is. Hee <laughs> hee. I don't know why who did it, or why. But watch your back, Sarah Senpai. Okay. Okay, I will watch my back, girl. Wait, why do I need to go downstairs, though? <gasps> oh my god, he's so cute. It's dark, but I'm using my night vision to search super thoroughly, Mia. He's really darting around. <gasps> oh, hypnotized. Hey, Jin. Can we talk about your last memories? S sounds like a complicated subject, Wolf. There are surely memories of ours that were erased. We have to get them back. How can we remember if they were erased, Mia? Hmm? Oh, uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, people's memories don't completely vanish. <gasps> Got it, Mia. Your reaction was funny, so I'll work with you, Wolf. Oh, I can't wait to see what this looks like. I know he's so cute. He asked this knowingly. Big sis Sarah, start from wherever, Mia. Okay, Midori, he said to use his lantern on everyone. Maybe this light stirs up the forgotten memories? It projects the things we can no longer see. 
We just have to try. <gasps> it's like Jimmy Neutron brain blast. Aw, what is this? Infirmary? The memory that's hazy for me was in the infirmary at school, Mia. It feels like it was fun. Or maybe scary. It's kind of hard to remember, Wolf. I want to remember it properly and clear it up, Mia. Is there something wrong with Jin's memory? Um... I don't know. Just, like, find the opposite? Literally, why did they let an elementary school kid into a death game? By using this lantern, maybe I can bring Jin's memory to light. Wait, how? Okay, touch the right screen to move the lantern's light. Oh! Um, excuse me, what's this? <gasps> Wait, that's the consent form. Okay. Oh, I understand. Okay. Then what? The chair he's sitting in? No, it's this. Top left of the that. Could you remember this part a little more? Because the rich death game people are crazy. They are crazy. <gasps> Mia, all memories on deck, Mia. Oh. <gasps> Fix this, Sarah. I think I might have remembered something important, Wolf. The great game about gambling and death game. Isn't Kaiji an older anime? Is it? I think I've heard of it, but I've never seen it. Huh? It was posted up there, Mia. The consent form. The consent form? I don't know why I forgot, Mia, but... Thinking back now, it was the same one, Wolf. Maybe I... But... Why? Calm down. Just take, take it slow. R right. Okay, and then there's this creature. It's a butterfly. But that's not a butterfly. That's like Archangel Michael. Okay. Can you remember this part a little more? Roger, Mia. That's a picture I drew. Huh? I never drew a picture of a butterfly wolf. That was... A picture of a butterfly that teacher brought, Mia. It was a really sucky drawing. Like a big ink stain, Wolf. An ink stain? Wait, she feels like she's seen this before? Have we seen this before? I don't think so. Is it a vampire? It's like one of those ink blots where they're like, what do you see? And then it's an elephant. But in actuality, if you see an elephant, you are unwell. My pictures are way better, Mia. You did a bit of research? Wait, like spoilers research? I'll give you rabies. If... <laughs> what research? You about to see some gin lore? Okay, okay, thank you. I'm scared. Big sis Sarah, we should draw portraits of each other someday, wolf. Well, now I wonder. You don't wanna, Mia? No, no, not at all. I look forward to it. Yay! I just hope he doesn't cry when he sees it. Okay, what else? Wait, let me look. Sar, that, the consent form, that, a person. Jin's outfit. Jin, could you remember yourself a little more? Of course, Mia. I mean, when it's myself. Big Sue Sarah. Sorry, Wolf, I lied, Mia. Back then, I was wearing the same outfit I am now, Wolf. Why are you apologizing? Sir, it's uncommon to go to school in an outfit like that, but... Wait, stop, I'm scared. Um... I'm okay now, but I used to not be able to go out if I wasn't wearing this, Mia. <gasps> That's so sad. I wanna know why, because I'm nosy. Why is that? Because... You don't wanna say? Sorry, Mia. I know I decided not to keep secrets from you, Big Sis Sarah. You can tell me anytime you want, Jin. No matter what it is, it won't make me hate you. Big Sis Sarah. Yeah, I love you, Big Sis. That's definitely the truth, Wolf. He's so cute. And the same to you, Jin. Yeah. I never paid it much mind before, but maybe that outfit... It could be very important to knowing Jin. Is it like a safety blanket of sorts? How do I get out of this? Like this looking- Oh wait, what's this? Gun? 
this pen holder with writing tools in it. Jin is literally, he literally is. He's so cute. Wait, I can also make that face. Hold on. I can also do that. Give me a second. Give me a second. Where is it? Which one is it? Oh, it's this one. Which one is it? Look. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, could you remember this part a little more? <gasps> Leave it to me, Mia. Hmm, it's pretty minor, but I was kind of curious about something, Wolf. <gasps> That's it, Mia. I know what it was, Wolf. There was an unfamiliar pen in the pen holder, Mia. An unfamiliar pen? <laughs> I go to the infirmary all the time, so I know, Wolf. A pen the usual infirmary person doesn't use. It only showed up when that teacher was there. What if this was like him being tested on so that he could be put into the death game? But then again, like what are, what's the criteria? Like what's the main baseline for wanting to be like pulling somebody into here? I know, Wolf, that pen. It's actually got a hidden camera. Meow. Say what? Spy stuff, Wolf. Some special service something from another country was targeting me, Mia. Wait, Princess Protection Program? Now that I think about it, wasn't I being targeted for real, Wolf? Wait, he's being for real? What sounds like a joke could be entirely true. Okay, uh, what are we missing? I got that, I got that. CIA. Wait, what is M16? What is that? Are we missing anything? Let's see. Medications. Oh wait, this box. Files on the shelves. Could you remember this part a little more? <gasps> meow meow, got it. Hold on, wolf. Meow, come to think of it. M-I-6. Is that like another CIA? All I know is the PPP, Princess Protection Program. Disney Channel original film. I feel like there was a black safe there, meow. When teacher talked to me, he'd always take papers out and write on them, Mia. He wouldn't show me what he wrote. I wonder what it was, Wolf. He kept it hidden from you? Yeah. I kind of didn't like it, because I felt like I was being observed, Mia. An observation log? Surely not. Jin Solo's Goku, real and true. Real and true, no lies. Okay, is that it? Wait, this. Awfully large first aid kit. Yeah, you're right. It is really big for a first aid kit, Wolf. <gasps> oh yeah, I remember, Wolf. It wasn't a first aid kit. I think it was a speaker, Yeah, They were doing like hypnosis therapy. What's going on? Teacher always said it would help me relax to play music while we talked, Wolf. Um, subliminals? Which means they were discussing things that made him nervous? We talked about school, and home, and all sorts of stuff, Mia. I wonder... The situation I'm looking at... Is it Jin getting counseling? What is it, Mia? No, no, it's nothing. Okay, is that it? Wait, this guy's different. <gasps> Leave it to me, Mia. Hmm, let's see. Oh no. Huh? Strange, yeah. The doctor's face. It's the same as Midori's wolf. <gasps> Why, Mia? Is that possible, wolf? Calm down, Jin. I don't think he was getting counseling. I think it was secret lobotomy stuff. We talked about all sorts of stuff together, Mia. About fun stuff, and some less fun stuff. I thought he was a good person for always hearing me out, Wolf. Now he wants to kill me. But teacher, was that guy, Mia? Even though he listened to all that stuff, he kidnapped me and made me have to do this, Wolf. That's so cruel, Mia. <laughs> so cruel. Jin, stay with me. Just hang on. All I could do was hug him until he stopped shaking. That's so sad. 
There was profiling him. That's what I think. Like, that's crazy. How? Who let him in? Big sis, Sarah. Thanks, Mia. Sorry. I shouldn't be digging up lost memories, should I? No. I want to know, Mia. Maybe I was being tricked, but... I want to know what's a lie and what's a real wolf. Big sis, Sarah. Work with me, Mia. Dude. <laughs> Whoa. I remember, Mia. Everything. Oh, here we go. My real memory was like this, Mia. He looks like a VTuber. Um, so the thing is... I don't really get all the details, but... I have this sort of condition called autism, Mia. If I don't wear this, I feel really embarrassed. You don't probably saw the staff view haunted. He literally did. Don't need to... Yeah, imagine. He's the school's, like, biggest, um... What's it called? Biggest sponsor. School's biggest sponsor. And then his, uh, what's it called? His criteria for the sponsorship money is to go in there, scope out the children, pick one, and then use him to be killed. Donor. Yes, yes. Ah, uh, yeah. Wait, where am I? If I don't wear this, I feel really embarrassed. I get nervous, woof. I know it's weird, Mia. It's okay. Nothing weird about that. Really? That's good, Meow. But he was the one who was all nice and told me I could get better, Woof. Aw, there's nothing wrong with him. <laughs> He's so cute. I'll be able to get along with everyone, Meow. <gasps> Sounds fun, Woof. There's lots of guys I don't like, but it's not like I don't want to play with them, Meow. <gasps> That's the spirit, Jin. Yes, have you seen Anzu? 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 I know Anzu. She... She's not dead yet. <laughs> I am now going to um, bite you and give you rabies. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I don't think Anzu is dead yet. Yeah. Mom Gord! Mom Gord! Strike one, strike one. <laughs> strike one. Strike two. Rabies. You'll get used to everyone little by little, and you'll make more friends. I hated school myself. I was quick to, ki to fight with people, so I didn't have friends. He was quick to kill. What is wrong with Mr. Boy? He's so cute. <laughs> huh, a delinquent, Mia. I thought you were better than that, Wolf. <laughs> I'm sure you'll grow up right, Jin. Your mother's delighted, too. R really, Mia? She doesn't think I'm a weird kid who's too much trouble, Wolf. She always sounds happy when she tells me about you. Wait, I can't e believe even the parents are, like, giving him information. <laughs> I'm gonna grow up quick and become a man mom can depend on, Wolf. Oh my god, what if I start crying? <laughs> He's so cute. Okay. Oh, really? I wonder, should I teach you the Asunaro vow? What's that, Mia? It goes like this. What I want to be today, Asunaro. Tomorrow I will be. If you write your name on this paper, I hear you can have any one wish granted. Okay, so who was allowing a minor to sign for his own papers? <gasps> really, Meow? It's a magic paper, Wolf. What do you wish for? Well, obviously, for mom to be healthy and live a long life, Mia. That is so sad. Why the slide whistle? That was not appropriate. Huh? You sure you don't want to wish for yourself? I'll be great on my own power, Wolf. But if mom isn't there with me, then I won't be able to show her, Mia. You really are a good kid, Jin. Hee <laughs> hee. I mean, I just love my mom, Mia. How is this allowed? I know, he still had him after hearing all that. If I, okay, pers okay, me personally, if I was Midori, and I was trying to get people to get into my killing game, and I came across Jin, and then he goes, I just want to save my mom, man. I would slowly pack up my papers and leave. Oops, that's what I would do. I would pack up my papers and leave. 
I signed it, Wolf. That paper. If I'm going through this now because of that, that's just awful, Mia. If I make Mom sad, there's no point, Wolf. Shut up! No! What are you doing? This was Jin's erased memory. We'll definitely make it home, Yao. Big sis Sarah and everyone else, we won't sacrifice anybody, Wolf. Alright. Okay, we're gonna kill Midori. <gasps> For my little boy. Okay, let's go to the library. Kana is this tall? Wait, she's gigantic. She's like 5'5? Five, 5'6? Five? Five, six? Is 6 foot? Wait, she's so tall. That's so tall. I was managed to make the lines. Wait, so hold on. I'm like rubbing my eyeball. <laughs> I was pretty managed to make some of the characters say after the lines like, woo, woof. Oh, I thought that was an exclamation mark. I was like, woo. <laughs> like, woof, not sound super cringe because I am the epitome of cringe. I embrace it. You know what I say to, is Joe still alive? No. No. I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway, to my friends, if they look really um, nice that day, I go, oh my gosh, you look so kawaii desu. And they look at me and they're like, please, please just be normal. <laughs> this book is really something. She's reading. Use lantern. Kana, lost memory time. M my memories? Yeah. Work with me to find the truth. We need to stand against Midori. I guess we need to do that. But looking at your memories might be a difficult task. You mean my sister, right? But if it's but it's alright. Kana's gotten at least a little bit stronger than before. And you're here with her, Sarah. I love how we all went from like Kana hate club to Kana love club. At first we were like, oh my god. You and your bucket need to go. Now she's kinda useful. Kinda. Five percent. Thanks, Kana. All right, then. Okay, go ahead. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, brain blast. She worked at a fast food restaurant? What is this? The memory Kana's wondering about was at the ice cream shop she went to with her sister. Her sister often went there on their way home. So she took Kana there for the first time. Y'all hated Kana. <laughs> because she betrayed us. She betrayed us. Yes, but now she's pulling her own weight. I think, okay, from the first two chapters, I think the people we hated most was Kana, so... Cue Toro, because he was a little useless, but he, he's doing better now. Who else did we hate? I think that was it, actually. I don't remember. We were just mostly hating, so... Um, but, you know, he's dead. Haha, <laughs> okay. But something strange... She can't be sure what really happened then. Wait, let's look. I can't tell. But let's do it. Okay, let's see. Let's start in this corner. Okay. Ice cream. Kyotaro, because he let Jin get injected. Oh, that's right. Jin was literally being injected by the poison of like 50 scorpions. Okay, this part. Yes, yes. Give me a moment. <gasps> I remembered. That was a big glowing ice cream. Awesome. I wish I could eat ice cream. Isn't that really cute? Kana wants to have one at her house. I do think it's fancy, but to have it in a room? Kana's always figured this was an ice cream shop, probably because she saw the light from outside. In reality, it was the shop of her dreams, filled with so many more kinds of sweets. Can you imagine? You think it's an ice cream shop and we're literally about to span down and it's like, um counseling again she knew her sister often went there too and she met up with me on the way home she'd wait there with ice cream in both hands jk we would eat our ice cream while chatting and then Kana. it's all right i'm the one who decided i'd face up to it okay okay let's keep going um okay let's go to that last okay the contract let's go to that last okay Sprinkles, let's... Okay. She got two bags. Okay. Okay, she got both legs, that's good. That's good. Um, the pistachios all gone. Uh, okay. Okay. Let's go back to Mr. Ice Cream Man, okay? Later. Yeah, he looks a little... 
A little different. A little green. But yes, it's my sister after all. Hmm. Oh, I remember that day. Kana got so excited about picking out a cake, she had her sister carry her bag. I see. I know that feeling. Aren't you an only child? Our happiness that night depended on that choice, so Kana absolutely couldn't choose wrong. Kana's sister watched her and waited patiently. What a good big sis. Me? I'd probably get engrossed in picking with her. Me too, we real. Um, do you think this could be a clue? Uh, of course. Of course it is. Well done, Kana. Hey, okay. Okay, what else? Let's see. Uh, the pistachio's all gone for some reason. Okay, leave it to me. I think it had a nice, mature level of sweetness, and it filled- oh, it was matcha. And it filled your mouth with a green tea flavor. <gasps> oh, I remember. Kana's sister ate too much of it, so they ran out of the green tea ice cream. Me! I love matcha ice cream. Wait, y'all ever had matcha ice cream? It is so, dare I say, bussin. <laughs> it's so good. She was really fond of it. She had it all the time. Kana was more drawn to the sweet vanilla and chocolate flavors. But that day in particular, her big sister watched as Kana act all mature to pick something out. Because they didn't have her favorite flavor. <gasps> matcha ice cream is so good. Matcha ice cream makes me feel like a caveman that has never had ice cream before in his life. Like if I could get on my hands and knees and like ooga booga and eat matcha ice cream out of the pint thing with my bare hands, I would. Also, it hurts my stomach, but I don't have matcha ice cream yet. You, yes, it's so good. I love matcha if it's like more bitter than it is normal. It, I don't know, normal? I don't know. Okay, guess we've saw at least one of the discrepancies. Um, beautiful. Wait, let's go to this first before we go to the two actual, like, important things. Paper ice cream coats on the wall. Hmm? Actually, I feel like there was a lot of writing. That's right. There were people's wishes. What is this? Have you seen the bacon ice cream? No, have you seen the ranch ice cream? Have you seen that? That's a scary. Wishes? I think customers at the shop would write them. Things like, I hope I won't put on weight, or I hope I won't get cavities. Such greed. I feel like I got curious about it and talked with the clerk. Hmm, but I don't remember what he said. I'm feeling kind of uneasy. Okay, so we about to look at the clerk now. Hello, Freddy. Was in the theater watching Game Tunes? Wait, what's, what's Game Tunes? Oh my god, speaking of theaters though, Haikyuu Battle of the- what is it called? It's, um, the new Haikyuu movie is coming to theaters in the United States. I could just throw up from happiness. Will it- be, when will it be my turn to die? Uh, next if you want. <laughs> next if you want. Yeah, he is the clerk. Clerk looking kind of green. Okay. Alright, um. Huh? Come to think of it, that clerk. Just fugly. He had the same face as Midori. Hmm, didn't see that coming. The dumpster battle? Yeah, battle of the trash peep. I saw that and I saw, I said, um, United States. And I was like, yippee. And then I looked at the date and I was like, what's the opposite of yippee? Like angry noises because I will not be in the United States <laughs> at that time. <laughs> why is life so cruel? Why is life so cruel? And why do good people, why are they undeserving of Haikyuu? What does that mean? Why was that man there? Has Kana met him before? And also, sister. How long had sister been going to that shop? Wait, okay, so it was Jin's mom feeding him info and now it was Kana's sister, unknowingly feeding him info. Maybe they really have been preparing for this for much longer than we thought? <laughs> uh, calm down, Kana. You wanna rest a little? <gasps> no, I'm fine. Let me continue. All right, girly bop, last thing. Here we go. The consent form. Uh, understood. You know, I feel like something was on that wall. <gasps> Why? But that's... What's wrong, Kana? That's strange. On the wall? 
was that consent form. And so what I don't understand is why are minors signing consent forms? Why? Hello, Biscuit. How are you? How have you been? You're just going to have to family sit literally. You know what? Like, I understand if he was going around saying, hey, I, your, your kid is so amazing. Like, do you want to be on America's Best Top Kids? But no. This is Japan's top death game. What does that mean? Kana saw that form there. And she feels like she asked the clerk about what it was. And then after that, um, uh, I can't remember. What in the world? Literally, what? Do they even have signature? Literally. Literally. Glad it's Friday. Me too. What's different? I thought that was it. I don't understand why minors are even signing consent form in the first place. What is this? Like ink? Okay, hold on. Something up here? Nor? Wait, ice cream. That has to be something I missed, right? Oh. Not the entire universe actually being wrong. Actually, I got it a little wrong. We visited that shop in the evening. The ice cream we ate while walking home from school was so tasty. And it was earlier than usual, so my sister decided to go to a different shop. That's why! To think they had cakes too. She must have been keeping quiet about it, I'm sure. You eat that much, Kana? You don't ask somebody that. Come to think of it, I wonder if us eating as we walked home is why sunsets made my tummy grumble. Not, um, what is that, like a Pavlonian response? What's that called again? Pavlog's dog? <laughs> oh, right, the doggy that ends up drooling just from ringing his meal bell. <gasps> That's so mean, Sarah. Oh, here we go. I remember. <laughs> and then her dark circles are back. What happened that day? I see this guy and his hair and my smile gets wiped so fast. My real memory was like this. I went to the sweets shop with my sister and there were many written wishes on the wall. Kana was looking through them, wondering if her sister put one up too. And among them was that form. Kana asked the clerk who her sister was familiar with. What'd you guys talk about? Hee <laughs> hee, do you know the Asunaru vow? The heck's that? It was that paper on the wall. The one that said, Consent form. Okay. If you write your name there, they say one of your wishes will come true. Is that a screw in her head? Is that like the new fashion of headbands? Okay. Anyway. Oh, there were lots of those little cards too. Guessing you wrote, I wish to stop wetting the bed. Okay, so Kugi, her older sister, why didn't she also think, oh my god, it's a consent form? That's a little sussy. What are you consenting to? What? I already have. Don't say such strange things in public. Oh, sorry. So? Kana couldn't think of anything, but also how does she balance that bucket so well on her head? The clerk gave her an idea. He said to grant your wish instead. Wait. Wait. Wait, hold on. Huh? Why do you look so upset? Oh, sorry. Let's see. My wish, huh? Maybe I'd wish for you to meet him, Kana. You're real. Huh? Hmm. <gasps> That's right, your fated partner, Kogi, you- Mm-mm. Uh-uh, Kogi's mean for that. That's so mean. You want a mug headband? How would a mug fit on our heads? Don't you want to meet your fated partner, Kana? Uh, I'm fine. You worry about that first, sister. Well, look who's talking. You sure? Once I get married, you will- We'll have to separate, you know. Uh, uh, fine by me. As long as someone shows up who loves you as much as Kana does, that is. <laughs> oh, that's so sweet. Looking back now, that clerk. I feel like he was Midori. That was Kana's erased memory. Kana just wanted her sister to be happy. After all, she brought her lots of happiness. Well, I still cannot believe I killed my guy right here. My, my handsome businessman.
dead in a ditch because I could not save him. I know, Kana's so sweet. That's actually so cute. I can't believe we used the hater. All I can do is gently hold her shoulders. Kana and her sister were so thoughtful toward each other. And yet, it's truly just awful. Wait, can we put the books back? No, we can't. Okay. Sorry, we were here. Let's go to here. No one. Okay. Let's go. Skule. We already went to Skule. Let's go to this. No one. Okay. Let's go here. Reiko. Wait, what's in here again? Changing room? Oh, charging room. Oh. <gasps> Anzu. Hey, um. Are you okay? She's checking up on Kuromata. Use lantern. Look at this lantern for me, Anzu. <gasps> no. I'm like, not good with that stuff. Wait, how come none of the dolls want to look at it? Is it because they actually don't... It's because they remember their memories? Or what? Like what? Nothing in the drawers. Anything? So he's just charging? The hell? Ain't the time to worry about me, is it? Use lantern. Look at this lantern. <laughs> Sorry to say, but I can't see too well. Okay. I wonder if his eyes took some damage too. That's funny. Okay. Let's go back in here. What's in here again? No one in here. Hmm. <gasps> Hi, John. How are you? Can I go down here? No, I can't. How has your day been? Wait, how do I? I record. Voice recorder, walkies, printed note, game star, blue, red, green, yellow. I don't care about all that. Door to the changing room. Oh, that's how you get there. Okay, let's go. Let's go back to Reiko then. Wait, wait. There's nothing else that we can actually find at this lantern. Can I go in here? Lantern's light is revealing the interior. Cool. Now you can see things. Wanted. Shinobu Goku Gokujo. Hades incident refugee. Let us know if you have a finger on his whereabouts. Are we finding his finger? Like, actually? Hades incident? Ugh. Jin, what's wrong? Hades incident. That was a murder spree between Yakuza a long time ago, Mia. How did you know that? Huh? Why do you know that, Jin? I don't know, Wolf. I just suddenly remembered. Is it because of the lantern? Someone told me, Mia. The person who survived in that incident took control of the underworld, Wolf. Education these days, huh? Good job. Good job remembering. Maybe that's one of your lost memories, too. Maybe you were Yakuza in a past life. Big sis, Sarah. Still one, huh? That means also Nara is looking for this person. If you have a finger on the criminal, huh? Oh? The finger- Don't tell me there's a finger inside. When I touched the text, it was a clicking sound. <gasps> Mia? Something fell out, Wolf. Obtain finger. <gasps> it's a Yakuza's pinky, Mia. Gross, Wolf. Oh, did he run off? Was that his noise running? Could this be a clue? Interesting. Oh my god, he's so cute. Look. Oh, and then he goes, Mia. Oh my god, he's so cute. Okay, so we're here. Let's see if there's any secrets in here. Show me a secret. No secrets. Here. Show me a secret. No secrets. Okay. Show me a secret. Hmm, too sussy. What about this one? It's green bright red. Huh? Shin? Maybe Jin's dad was Yakuza? Could you imagine? Who's the dead guy in the room Kana's in? Oh, what's his name? Hayasaka? Okay, so this is what happened. So he's really handsome. This is what he looks like. Here, let me show you. Because I remember I saw him and I was like, oh my lord. He... I believe his name is Hayasaka. Okay, here it is. He's just like a little business guy. He's a little business guy. That's what he looks like. 
but he's like a little business guy. How do I save this picture? Oh, well, his name's Hayasaka. I can't save it, but his name is Hayasaka. Um, and what happened was that there was like this monster fighting mini game, and I, I, I lost many times. I lost many times, and then he got eaten by books. He got eaten by literature, and so now his dead body is just there for all of us to, you know what, like smell. I don't know, like the fumes from the dead. I don't know. Okay, Shin AI. Oh, no, no. Shin, what's the matter? I, uh, I, I won't, I won't tell. No, 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 I, no, not anyone. Help. Oh no, <gasps> the screen. Was he killed? How do you kill an AI? As punishment for giving us too many hints. I've... I've let so die. Again, SMH. Okay. Hmm. Anything else I can do? Ranmaru. Where is he? Where is he? Video? Literally, by Shin AI... As if we G as if we G A F. Haha. <laughs> Where is Ranmaru? Hmm. Find anything in here? No. Is there anything? Wait, we didn't use it in here. The marsh marsh marsh. Oh wait. Consent form. Painted over part is glowing from the lantern. It won't come off. Okay, dang it. Hold this. Some text got revealed. It says watch out above, be careful when you're alone. The ceiling? I don't see anything. <gasps> hello! 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 Oh. How are you? Welcome! up! Welcome, mouse. A hand fell down. Whose is this? Huh? It's a doll hand. Looks like a note fell with it. It reads, an upgrade part gift. The steam spray hand. Upgrade part. Don't tell me. This can be a t- Erm, what the flip? <laughs> <laughs> okay, now can we go somewhere else? Is there anything else? Now you show up. Where you been? <gasps> Wait, are we gonna give him a steam upgrade hand? Hello? <gasps> Sarah, it's terrible. I was here checking out the broadcast equipment. But the Shin AI that was on this monitor? Yeah, he was probably killed the Midori. So you knew? I want to get revenge, but... I know. Let's do what we can. I'm gonna look at these machines some more. Come here if you need me. Wait, I thought we were gonna give him the hand. Can we not? Well, let's go back to Reiko then. We know about her past. She was in the band. <sighs> her brother was a murderer. Nothing. Interesting. Open safe on the floor. Can I get water? How do I use this trick machine? Oh, it consumes battery. Your door's on the M train of thought. Wait, what is M train? Talk. How you feeling? How you feeling, my man? Not too terrible. Seems he's charging up well. Hmm. Turn that off. Okay. I want to use this. Can I not? Though it consumes charge from the battery. Big charger. Mur oh! Not too terrible. Okay. Do I have battery? Midori. Real. Hmm. I wonder how to get how to clean this up. I thought we could give this to Romer, but I guess not. Like this? Consent form stuff. Try wiping it off, it didn't work. There was only some way to remove it. Can we use this? I'm confused. We can't use this? I wanna... So do we have to get that arm to him? Hey man. 
Oh, he's still talking. Okay, talk. Hey, Ramaru, about upgrade parts. Oh, you found that? Y yeah, I'm, I'm guessing any of the dummies would be able to swap their hand out for this. All right, fine, pass it to me. You sure? Well, you came specific, specific, specific. Well, you came specifically so to show me, right? So, look natural on me. Doesn't feel too hot. Now use it. Well, hurry up and show me. How? Good point. It said steam spray hand, so I'm sure it can do something along those lines. Steam spray. You probably need moisture for that, you know. Moisture. All right, I'll come with. Let's find a way to use this. <gasps> Yay, and maybe this too. What'd she take? A finger? I found it in the police box. May it might be another part you can use. Hand over the finger as well. You're not just voicing junk on me, right? Moisture. Pink machine? Drink machine. Give Ramuru water. Yes! Ramuru, drink some water. Whoa, what? What's this about now? I mean, if we use this, it'll use that battery from the charger. Fine by me. You got an idea, don't you? I did not mean to say that so country like I did. Kuromata. Well, I'll have a ginger ale. Only sweet drinks for you, huh? He downed a ginger ale. Dang, more acidic than I expected. I've never had ginger ale. So now what? Now, maybe you can use the steam spray. <gasps> Got it, let's try it out. But it's not like we should just casually use it. If a good use comes along, we'll try it then. Wait, can I use it on the consent form now? Uh, wait, let me turn it up. Oh, the consent form. Is there any way to know what that painted part says? Okay. <gasps> steam spray. Ramaru, the steam spray. <gasps> gotcha. Washa, 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 washa. <gasps> it says, I agreed to devout myself to Asunara for granting my wish. All you gotta do is sign your name too? What's this mean? Devote myself to Asunaru. It means exactly what it says. Asunaro. Giving yourself up to Asunaro. You could take it to mean, I won't complain even if you play with my life in a death game. In exchange for just a single wish. This is not, this is not okay. It ain't possible. No way we sign something like that. This <laughs> invitation to the death game. Then what about me? Midori pressured me to sign this. Saying mine would be the last one. See, that's a thing. So Sarah didn't sign it. So how is she in the game? I'm so sussy about her dad. Then, why am I here? But, uh, yes. Midori probably voted Jeffrey Bezos for president. It just fits the mighty game. Why? Ah, uh, what if? What would happen if I wished to put an end to the death game? What? Would it all end? At the cost of my life? You know what? That is a noble sacrifice. She doesn't really have much left. But also, if she were to die, I would imagine Jin would be very sad. And the last thing I want to do is make Jin sad. Sar. Don't think any stupid ideas. There'd be no point. I wouldn't want that. It's just an idea, really. But if that were possible, I felt like a cold wind blew a crack in my heart. I've come all this way, constantly thinking that I wanted to live, that I didn't want to die. And yet, the opposite feeling tugs at my heart. If I died, it'd be easier. If I died, everyone could be saved. No. Do we have to pay up with these powerful- yes. I feel like even if she did that, they would go, okay, shoots her dead, but then at the same time, we'll shoot everyone else dead. No, I can't feel this way. It's no different from giving in. Let's go, Ramaru. I have to get away from this place. Bye. What? Hey, Sarah. What is it? Hurry. I don't want you to die, Sarah. <gasps> Ramaru, you dog. So, so, um... What do you think about winning? Huh? What's he saying all of a sudden? Maple told us, right? Winning? 
What does he mean? Betraying everyone and... Don't get such strange ideas, Ramaru. I want us all to escape together. Y yeah, of course. We'll all escape. Together. But... Is that really gonna be possible? He's such a pessimist. Come on, man. Ramaru. Look, I... When I'm with you, Sarah, I feel more and more like I want to live. The more serious I get, the more afraid I am to die. Seeing Kuromata, I realize I don't want to die now. That's the same for all of us. Which is why you have to win, right? If I want to get out of this alive, all I have to do is take you out, Sarah. What, you want to kill me? But I can't do something like that. On the other hand, I'm sure I could kill anyone else. Why would you need to kill anyone else? Like, why? That doesn't make any sense. Hi, hi. Listen, Sarah. Win for me. You're on, Maru. Get a grip. If I could slap him, pa pa. We're all allies. We've overcome hardship together. Reiko, Kyutaro, they protected us even as they were hurt. When Jin and Connor were taken by suspicion, they still believed in us and gave us courage. So never say something like that again. Sorry. I'm such a piece of shit. <laughs> I had no right to be your friend. Okay, he's a little dramatic. <laughs> oh. Oh, I'm so sorry. This is actually an emotional part. I'm so sorry. The more you want to live, the more real death feels. I'm sure Ron Maru had given up at first. Mm-hmm. It was me who gave him hope. Yeah, I feel like this moment actually went from zero to a hundred, and it's actually so much more emotional than I voiced it to be. But I can't make a choice like that. I... This is no time to be crying. We'll all return together. I don't intend to abandon anyone. Ron Maru... That includes you, dog. Mm-hmm. Let's go. Okay. Huh? how boring. I thought you'd finally wake up, Miss Sarah. But alas, you're still the dependable leader. Midori. He saw all that. I love his theme song. It's so, like, crazy. Boy, the chaos one little piece of paper can cause. Ha-ha. <laughs> What's so funny? I mean, I had everyone sign this form to have them participate in the death game, see? So of course, I wouldn't accept to put an end to it. Though for the record, I'd be fine granting a wish that gives you an advantage. Why am I here? Why am I here? I never signed that consent form. And yet... The fact that you're here... Must be because someone wished so. Surely? Who? Joe? Kai? They literally did. Well, never mind that. I really think it's a shame, Miss Sarah. I so wanted you to wake up. To see the awakening of the ultimate Sarah Chidoin. What does he know that I don't? What's that supposed to mean? Huh. So you don't even know. My miscalculation was having Joe take part. Okay, so now we know, I guess, that Joe was not the one that wished for us to be there. What? I was opposed from the beginning, you know? To the silly balancing business. I, I can't see where you're going with this. Miss Sarah, what do you think these victory percentage you've been carrying around are for? Yes, those. Did you think we were placing bets? Oh, I did. Jin's a dark horse, a hundred thousand yen. Like that. So then, what did you prepare them for? This death game must be a holy event. Everyone must be given a fair chance, a way to survive. In other words, the victory rates had to be made equal. What does that mean? Equal? Exactly. In short, you were assigned handicaps. What's mine? Wait, what? So the weak were given helpers. The weak were given helpers. Balancing the victory percentages. Wait, who? 
So for that stupid reason, I know he's about to talk equality, but like what? That's strange. That's odd. Because don't I have the highest victory rate? Giving me an ally doesn't make sense. Haha, <laughs> that's why it's curious. You see, Miss Sarah, when you have an ally, you're weaker. <laughs> oh, I remember it. In the world without Joe, you were a truly terrifying sight to behold. Wait, what? Oh, did they like run? Is that what happened? They ran like AI simulations? And she killed everybody and everything? A stronger survival instinct than anyone else. A heart that would never give in. Such resourcefulness, strategy, and cunning. You use any means to survive. And the most terrifying part? Was how you used the death of others. After killing them, you shed tears and tugged at everyone's heartstrings. Such tremendous charisma, even though you had zero intent of self-sacrifice. As the AI test continued, even I got shivers down my spine. Haha, <gasps> if I could have met you like that. <laughs> He's so creepy. But hey, have to obey the will of the organization. I'm an adult after all. You know, Simulation Sarah was insane. Well, Miss Sarah, did Joe do a good job dragging you down? It, it can't be. Are you saying Joe was killed for a reason like that? That means he didn't have to be there. <gasps> that was me. Get your hands off me. Hey, you think you can win? <laughs> You're not getting away with this. This isn't the kind of method I wanted from you. <gasps> Give them back. Joe, everyone. By everyone, you mean... Now, <laughs> and Kai. The people whose names aren't on the list. They had no connection to anything, right? And you used them like toys for the most worthless of reasons. We were all just living regular lives. Giving our all to live normally. <sighs> oh dear, you really have gotten too kind. <gasps> oh my lord, because that's not you, is it, Sarah? You're far more deceptive and despicable and demonic and bewitching and supreme. Go back to the way you were then, Sarah. He's so creepy. Stop it. Huh? You're still here? Say. Did you really intend to kill me just now? Why, well, that's strange. If you did that, you die, remember? Shut up. You're human garbage. I'll kill you, bastard. Hmm. Are you going to drag Miss Sarah down too? I know Midori is actually crazy. He's too... He needs to be more doll-like. He needs to be more like Saffalin. What? <gasps> Not again. My goaler. It's the tag finale. Gotta touch someone or you're gonna die. I'll have you disappear too, Ramaru. For Miss Sarah's sake. Wait, I forgot that they were supposed to tag him. So why can't they just lunge right now? No taxi backsies, right? Like, no tag backs. And give me a good show, won't you, Miss Sarah? Hmm. Damn it, Midori. Let's go after him, Sarah. Joe, he was brought along with me. The worst. It happened for the worst reason. That's so crazy. He actually died for no reason. Like, no reason at all. Ronmaru? Shoot, I have to go after him. Where did he go? Like, where? Um, okay. So, like, he's about to die. So, let's not... <gasps> Ranmaru! There you are. So you're we here. Uh. Hmm, your collar's glowing. This tag shit again, huh? Ranmaru, you can't give up, dog. There's no one here but Kurumada. Ranmaru? Do it. <laughs> I dare you. What are you saying? You wanna live, right? I, our futures, I can't see one for me, but I can see one for you. Wait, Kurumata's such a bro. 
Don't you dare do it. Don't you dare, man. <laughs> what am I even doing? I know this is wrong. I've just lost the courage to stand against our enemy. Then what are you gonna do? If you beat Midori, you'll just die. I don't know. What should I? She's back. I can't stand to watch this. He, he, he not going? <gasps> what is Miss Girl doing? What's it? Come on, we'll do something about that collar. Wait, what is that? I wanna go. Wait, should I save? Let's save. I'm sus. I'm sus down right now. Okay, let's go. Proceed. Oh, oh, that's not, that does not look safe. A strange device stretches across the room. What is this? A collar reset device. How does she know that? Where does she find this? Uh? A reset? For the bomb? And how the hell do you know that, Hinako? Uh, oh, I don't know. Just suddenly remembered. You don't have to believe me. But do you have any other way? <laughs> no objections? Alright. Sarah Senpai, call everyone here. Uh, everyone? Yep. It's a pretty intense device, apparently. We'll need cooperation. Wait, so all of us are gonna get hooked up to this thing? One, two, three, all of us? So, this is a machine for resetting collars? Ain't that huge news? Disabling these collars that restrain us. If we can all deactivate them, we won't have to be afraid anymore, Mia. It's not that all-powerful, people. It can only do it for dummies. And also, it just disables the tag mode. I think. Oh, Mia. To do that, everyone will put themselves at risk. A at risk? This device forces a reset by sending electric currents. Using our bodies as conduits, that is. The hell? Relax, it won't be enough to kill you. But if somebody passes out midway, we fail. Ramuru's gonna die. Okay, so if I fail this mini game, little mushroom head is gonna die. So, I hope, I hope I pass. Then we just gotta do it. Whoosh. Right, we can handle that much. Ramu's our ally. We definitely save him. Everybody. Guys. <laughs> guys. Oh my lord, guys. <laughs> Yikes, it's gonna. Hurry, stand in the center. That don't look safe. Guys, I'm counting on you. Let's do it. <gasps> okay, let's go. I think I saved, actually. Here we go. Yeah, time to save our bro. Okay, so somehow we have to give him all of the electricity so that this resets. Okay. Grab the electrodes, everyone. I'm turning it on. Okay. Okay, so here's how it works. Oh, I'll explain. Where did he come from? <laughs> Meow? See, we did. Whoa there. You'll fail if you let go. Just stay right where you are. Listen up. The objective of this game is to gather electricity on Ranmaru. The electrodes you're holding onto will be sent electric shocks at random. So do your best sending that current toward Ranmaru. Oh, okay. His collar is making a warning sound, so he might die. Now take a look at the monitor on the ceiling. Up next too. That's the number of people who will be sent a shock next. Okay. What happens when the shot comes in? <gasps> Our health bars. Yeah! That, that's stronger than I expected. <gasps> Isn't it? That's the first shot. You get more electrified each time yours out. Let's try it once more. Um, please stop. That was the second shot. And if you get more and more electrified... <gasps> three shocks. This is the limit. If you, get take a, if you take a fourth shot, you'll pass out. And then Ramaru dies. You mean? If just one person faints, you fail this game. And you know what that means. We can't save Ramaru. But there is one way to, of resetting your charge back to zero. 
A girl, what is this? Hold on. So if she sends it to me, why are you sending your callers to one another? Hey, Miss Sarah, press that switch next to you. Me? Okay. Ow. The electricity. Electricity flows to the person who pressed the switch. In exchange, well, just take a look. The other people on your circuit got reset, see? Absorb, absorb charge onto yourself to protect others. That's what the game is. Uh, this uh, sounds really complicated. What about me? Did I say that already? So he needs to be the yellow. So Reiko, Ramaru, I don't know what the other side of this one's leading to. Unlike everyone else, Ramaru has to gather electricity. Plenty of it, enough to make him faint. Seriously? So basically, give charge to Ramaru and keep it off of others. Wait, that actually sounds simple. Well then, it's time to get started. Okay, let's see. Let's start. Clear my charge first. Let's start now. Explain again. Let's just start. Let's start now. Okay. Nice and obedient. Well, good luck. Mmm, Kurumada. Okay, okay. Oh, JK. Okay. What's this one? Wiring changed. I guess it all changes. So, said it's him. I'll collect some charge. Go with that. Okay. This seems easy. Number of people receiving shocks. Okay, so. Car is a warning sound. Oh, shoot. So now it's Jin, Kurumada, Reiko. So I have to pass this around somehow. Okay, so let's pass this to Kurumada. Because then I can't give this to Reiko. Let's pass this to him. Okay. This is very, like, puzzle gamey. Oh, shoot. Kurumada. Dang it. Oh, wait. Yellow, yellow, Jin. She might faint. He might faint. Frick. Wait, I did something wrong. I did something bad. Okay, let's send it to myself. Go with this. I think we died. Like, like immediately in. Okay. Oh, cool. Okay, so he's still alive. Okay. Oh, yes. Wait, we got it. Okay. Okay. I have a lot. It's okay, though. Let's see. So, this is red. Yellow. We need to get rid of her somehow. So, let's give hers to Reiko. But also me. Because it's like a roulette. Like, you just don't know. So, I'm just going to give hers and just save myself. Okay, here we go. Oh, <gasps> shoot, it was me. Okay, okay, it's fine. It's fine. We're okay. I'll leave it back to her. Okay. Because he can't have any yet. Because he is red. And none of the red ones have anything. This is for her. So let's see if we can get Kurumadas to somewhere. Dang it, this sucks. It's just hard, like, to pass him with electricity. But then also making sure that everyone stays alive. I think now we're fine. Okay, so he's red. <gasps> yes. Okay, he has one more turn. <gasps> We're doing okay. Okay, now blue. <gasps> Wait, I think I got it. From Jin. Owie. Alright, I've collected enough. Wait, that was easy. The collar is giving off a burnt smell, but still functions. Oh dear. Sorry, seems it is built a little too sturdy. Wait, we gotta keep going? Get the charge again. What? Oh, I thought it was that easy. Shoot. Okay, red. No one. I need to give it to someone. Let's give it to... Where'd it go? Okay. These two are like very sus. Okay, okay, here we go. So it's him now. We need to focus on Kurumada. Please give it to him. Shoot. Uh, let's give it to Jin. Okay. I know this game is so sadistic. Who's next, Reiko? Dang it. 
just takes too many. Okay, red. Kana. Jin. Shoot. Wait, two of them. <gasps> it's over. I think we died. <gasps> oh, wait. But then Ray goes. Hopefully she doesn't get hit next. <gasps> nice. Okay, okay. Please. This. Wait, can I give it to him? Oh, I can't. Hang it. He's dead. Okay, I have to pass Reiko's out. So, let's give this. Okay. Awesome. Okay, she has to be next. Hopefully, she'll go towards Ramaru, though. If I'm lucky. Oh my god, I'm so lucky. Hey, what if you can get both? Dang it. It just sucks, because even if they have a lawn, he only gets one. Okay, Jin. Please. Dang it. Okay, let's do me. Okay. We're still alive. I mean, I'm doing good. But this blue one. Is it Jin or is it her? Okay, let's do her. This is actually really easy. Oh, just kidding. Okay, let's look. Now it's Kana. Oh, <gasps> nice. Wait, I have really good RNG today. Hopefully that didn't like jinx anything. All right. College making strange sounds, but still barely functions. <gasps> How unfortunate. That's real, it's 30 stuff. Give me a break. Okay, this is the last one, I guess. I know our RNG held so good. Oh, it's still going. Hi, Spider-Man. How are you doing today? Welcome. We're playing a little puzzle game. And what we're trying to do is like, uh, electrify this little white guy, like this white hair guy. Um, anyone from the yellow? No. So let's pass this on. I wish we could give it to him, but he's already dead. Which sucks. Okay. Okay. We're doing okay. I'm doing good. I didn't stream for like a week. It feels like. I'm glad to be back a little bit. Okay, let's go. We're almost there. This is actually really easy. Okay. No, it's these two. Jin. Um, for now, let's just pass it on. Okay. Oh, dang it, Kana. Okay, okay. That's okay. That's okay, because my RNG is gor gorgeous. My RNG says, give the gin. Okay. We're doing okay. Okay. I should have seen that coming. Shoot. Oh, cool, Reiko. Actually. Oh, I'm scared. I can send this over, but I think we should give it to Reiko because he's red. Okay, it's fine. Oh, shoot. Oh, this sucks. Actually, let's give this on this side. I should have just went with it. I'm scared. Oh, yes. Okay, we're okay. We're okay. Please send it to me. Shoot. Let's see. Yellow. Blue. We have to send this. Okay, I'm going to send hers to Kana. I think we're okay still. No! No, we were so close! No, we were so close. It's okay if he dies, right? Oh no, we're fine. I'm not gonna try and save him. Alright, um... Dear Father in Heaven, my bad. No, I'll redo? You want us to redo it? Okay, hold on. Let me see if I can exit out of this. Hold on. Um... Okay, I kind of do want to save him. Wait, but, but like, what does he do for me? Does he do anything for me? Should we save him? Let's just watch how, what, how, how his death goes out. Let's, let's watch. Redo from, I think you should have done one redo because three times was a bitch much. Yeah, I thought it was two. Okay, let's do one redo. I had already saved, so I think I just exit out of the game. Okay. <laughs> Okay, Ramaro, you get a second chance at life.
You're getting a second chance. People appreciate you too much. Let's go. I'm gonna skip all this. Because we're doing know how to do it. Okay. Okay, let's skip this. Okay, I'm gonna skip this. This time our RNG will be so good. I just know it. Who would have known that Sarah was gonna get hit? That was a really bad roulette at the very end. Okay. Here we go. We're getting into it. Oh wait, can I save? I'll save right here actually. Okay, there we go, let's go. Okay, we got it. We got it. We're gonna save him and he's gonna live. Okay, here we go. Yeah, skip all this. I already know how to do this. Skip, skip, skip. Okay. Second shock, fourth shock, faint. He has to live. Let's listen to myself. Okay. Okay, here we go. Let's start. Then let's save. I can save here. Save game. Okay, here we go. Sar, let's see. There's nothing going on, but I have to send something. So I'm just gonna send it to her. Okay, here we go. A game of RNG. Awesome. I just need to focus on sending it to him now and be less focused on saving a lot of people until I absolutely have to. Okay, see, we're fine. Yellow, awesome. I just think I was too focused on saving people earlier. Like this right here. But they can get three, like three chances. Um, blue, yes. Okay. Yellow, awesome. There goes one. Okay, we have two more. Okay. Let's save. Save game. And then send it to him. And that killed two people, that like took away two. Okay. Now. Guys, there actually is like more strategy. Oh my God, wait, aren't you? More strategy in this than I thought. Okay, who, oh, those two, both of them, awesome, okay. Actually, amazing, okay. Um, that sucks. Poor Anzu. Oh, poor Anzu. She looks so scared. Blue. I have to, I have to save people. Even though he needs two more to pass this round. We're fine. Okay. Red? <gasps> no one. Oh wait, he has to live from Kana. Oh, I know, Anzu looks terrified. I never noticed that if they hit in the red, they get like freak, like more freaked out. But, like Raiko doesn't look freaked out. So yellow. <gasps> nice. That's two. Okay, one more. Wait, you were so right, Flash, to give him a second chance at life. Here we go. Okay, blue, there's no one. So let's give it to her. Okay. Uh, red, okay, but that, okay, let's give it to him. Thanks, Brian. Hi, Reeve. How are you? It's going okay. 
RNG gods are smiling down upon me, maybe. I'm not sure though. Let's see, he's dead, freak. Okay. Okay, I can really give it to him because there's some right there, but I have to pass it on, I think, because she's red. Okay. Awesome. Okay, I think this is it again. Round three is hard. Let's see. Red, yellow. I'm just gonna do it. Awesome. Okay. I have to trust in myself. Okay, now, I can pass this on to Sarah. Start the first episode of Fallout show. Wait, what is that? Okay, Kurumada. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Kurumada. Oh my god, speaking of yas, last week, not last week, this past Wednesday, my dad texted me and he was like, do you want this food? Um, and then I didn't realize that I said yas, I, capital Y-A-S instead of yes. And he didn't understand what yas meant. So then he called me in the middle when I was playing Lethal Company and he goes, what does that mean? <laughs> Oh, right. It means yes, I do want the food. Please, thank you. Anyone? <gasps> we got it! A show based on the Fallout game. Oh, okay. Sounds interesting. <gasps> we won! I don't like that noise. It's like that, y'all know like the mosquito killers? Like the uh, tennis racket that looks like a, the tennis racket that kills mosquitoes? That's what it sounds like. <gasps> we did it! It stopped! That means we were able to reset it, right? Aw, so boring. All right, I'll accept the loss this time. I'll have to prepare more fun trap next time. Yeah, bug zapper, that's what it sounds like. Guys, I'm real sorry. I'm... Hold up. That ain't what you said here, is it? Uh, um, thanks. You saved me. Hey, <laughs> good for you. Ranmaru. Um, so, Sarah, if it were for, if it were for your sake, Sarah, um, <gasps> what's this? What you talking about? Um, no, no, for, forget us anything. Was he about to tell me that he has a crush on me? Right. At any rate, let's get out of here. The elevator just started back up. I don't think that's good, because you know what's around? A rampaging monster that can kill us. We can go to the lower floor? Right. We need to get there before Midori. It'll be bad news if it gets blocked again. You're, you're right. Let's go, Sarah. To the lower floor. I know Maple might be here. Please let them all be safe. Okay, let's save. Wait. So glad he got a second chance to live. Um, Kurumada. Please stay behind here. Literally, Maple, she just smashes everything. She takes her little tentacle, like, stabbers and stabs people. We're about to look like this. What are you saying now, brat? You can't try to hide it. Those shocks put you in a bad way again. If you stay here, you can charge at any time. Fine. Huh? Don't die, Kana. <gasps> right. That's right, we have the transceivers. We have the walkies. Kurumada, please hold on to one of these. Hmm? Gave Kurumada one of the transceivers. Oh, so I can keep in contact with this? I'll call if anything comes up. Get going. Okay, bye bye. He looks like Goku. Let's go. <gasps> Boy, get out of that. It's gonna close. Hurry, hurry. Oh my god, he's so annoying. Buzz off, bastard. You want us to get on with you? What should we do? Get on with him. We're just moving together. It'll be fine, right? Right? Yeah, I'd hate to let him walk all over me. I'm scared. We're gonna get on and then he's gonna like, like it, the doors are gonna open and then he's gonna kick us out and then close the door and so it cuts our body in half. Long. Going down just one floor feels unbearably long. Because next to us is the enemy we need to kill. Why he slide in like that? Why? You're too nervous, Miss Sarah. Even when he's this close, I can't do anything. Yank on his little pigtail. <laughs> Let's go. Beat Midori to the punch. 
I'll just take my sweet time. Okay. Okay, sussy. Okay, let's go find KG. Where's my boy? You little yink that rat tail. <gasps> the shutter's closed. I forgot I did that. Yeah, the shutter's closed. So we can't get into the cemetery, Wolf. Right, it's still closed like when we left it. In fact, this shutter seems to have taken damage from something big and sharp. Maple. Maple inflicted this damage. To do this much to a bulky, sturdy shutter. Seems a whole lot stronger than Midori. Just imagine Midori walks in. <laughs> He's so evil. He's disgusting. But it ain't been pierced through. Then Keiji must be saved. Okay, let's... There's literally this right here, girl. Let's go. Card reader. Okay, let's get in. I hope he's alive. All right, it opens, Sarah. He must be waiting up ahead. Let's go. Casey. <laughs> Casey. <laughs> Mr. Policeman, where are you, Mia? Oof, kind of hot in here. It's musty dusty. Casey? Hey, hey, big sis Sarah? Why aren't the coffins open, Meow? Come to think of it, maybe after Keishi got out, he closed them and left. I don't think so. I don't think so. Um, I, I wonder if maybe the coffins didn't unlock. Don't be ridiculous. We opened them from the control room. I'm sure of it. It said all the coffins were open. But, but... The hourglass is still on the coffin. <gasps> that, that doesn't matter. What's wrong, everyone? Why are you suddenly getting timid? I don't know, my Mr. Policeman is still alive. The hourglass, it's just a trivial detail, right? But, big sis, Sarah. They're wrong. The coffin, all is with the coffin. Okay, girl, I don't know about that. The coffin. Do you hear a weird noise? I can hear a low roaring sound from the cop, like a monster. That sounds just like, but, but please calm down. It's okay. I'll take my time and look, just open it, girl. Just rip the bandaid off. Put my hand on the coffin. Ugh. What's the matter? Sarah, it feels hot. The coffin has a considerable heat to it. I feel like I just heard a voice from inside. Stop it. <laughs> no, this isn't. Why isn't Keiji here? The shutter was still closed. What's happening in the coffin now? Answers I don't want to consider surface in my mind. He's alive, right? There's no way. The cremation system. Keiji. I grab the lid to open the coffin. The heat doesn't matter. I use all my strength to pull the lid. But as hard as I try, the lid won't come off. Open up. Open up the safe. <laughs> it's not even budging, Mia. It's no use. It's getting hotter and hotter. Your hands are gonna. But Keiji, <laughs> Keiji, he's inside. He needs our help. Get away, Sarah. No, I need to help Keiji. Okay, let's see. Did we get him? They never unlocked. Awesome, so we didn't get him. Right now, right in front of us is gonna be Mabel. Keiji's being burned alive, okay. Awesome. There's nothing I can do. Keiji is being engulfed in flames in there, dying. Awesome. Awesome. The sound of roaring flames torments my ears. My vision warps. My policeman is dead. Do you need aid? You need to shut up. Midori. You might still have time, you know. Oh, I signed that right away. I'm fine either way, personally. Can you save him? <gasps> That's the only thing I can do is sign the form. Dang. There's no time to question. There's only one option. To believe him and sign. There's no other. <laughs> I did it. I did it. You finally signed for me, Sarah. Now hurry up and open the coffin. Because she's going to die. Midori pointed a remote at the coffin. <gasps> Sorry. Seems you weren't in time. 
Huh? The heat smelted the lid, fusing it to the coffin. This is sick. Sickening. It's physically impossible. Too bad. Tee petal. Girl, that can't. You lied. That it could be opened. Why, I didn't tell a single lie. All I ever said from the start was I'll tell you a way to save him. So you're just saying you tricked her? In case you did, I've been tricked. I don't care about that. Right in front of me, Keiji is... Keiji is... Oh, wait, Keiji's dead? But then why did I play all those dumb games for? Hold up. This ain't right. Hey, was Keiji really in there? Uh, I, I mean, the hourglass... The coffin's closed, Mia. And the, the hourglass is on top. That's what's so strange. Okay, Detective Ramaru. How could a living human be so quiet while he's getting burned alive? True. He should have struggled and shouted some more, I suppose. Did he not even have the strength for that? No, that ain't it. He escaped from out of this coffin. No shit. Then... But, but the shutter was closed. He must be in here. That part, I don't know about... But there was Kyutaro and Mai who could use the fingerprint scanner. I'm sure something happened, so he's just not here, that's all. We should look for him. This ain't the time to get down the dump, Sarah. Oh, Maru, okay. I believe you. Yeah, I believe you, and I believe in Keiji. Keiji, he... He has to be somewhere. We need to meet up. I love how optimistic she is, but... She already signed her life away. So... Right. Can you stand, Sarah? Thank you, Ranmaru. So, like, I don't think that it even matters anymore. We already signed our life away. Goodbye. Let's go. Oh! Miss Maple. That's Maple. Stay away, Sarah. She doesn't seem to have noticed us. Is she? Sitting and resting? No. She ain't moving, is she? Did someone kill her? She's completely stopped. Did, did she run out of battery, Mia? Or in other words, she's dead. Wait, I liked her. She was cute. She went on a rampage and exhausted her energy. Never got to give her back that ID card. Mabel. Is this our fault, too? I'm sorry. Wait, Mabel. She's actually dead? Boo. Lantern. Okay, let's go back. Oh, let's go back in here and do the lantern, actually. Lantern. Oh, not turn on. Is it broken? Wait, that's weird. Okay, let's go up here now. <gasps> hey! Sarah, I'm glad to see you. <gasps> Bye! Where's Gigi? Where's Gigi? You seen him? I haven't. Calm down. Hi, Conway. How are you? How's your day been? Th then what about Muscle Gorilla? Why isn't he with you, Meow? Relax. Since he's injured, I'm having him hide. Really, Wolf? I'm so glad, Mia. Sorry we couldn't have come quicker. But tell me, how's Kuromata? Uh, Kuromata's safe, too. He's charging up in the charging room. Oh, I see. That's great. Wait, she's kind of sussy. Hey, everyone. I found out something huge. A way we can beat Midori with the dummy still alive. Well, girl, so we lost one. Like, I don't know if you remember, but one's dead. He's dead in the library. What? Huh? No way. That's amazing, Mai. Uh, so you see. We need the ID card for it. I don't got it. Oh, I don't have it. <gasps> Thanks, it, Sarah. You shouldn't lie, meow. <gasps> oh, good. Wait, why did he rat me out like that? Why did he rat me out? He ratted me out so fast, so hard, so quick. Hand it over, pretty please. I'll go give it to Q, Taro. Huh? You won't let us... You won't let us meet him? <gasps> you can't. He's concentrating really hard. On what? 
He's got like two brain cells. I don't know what Kutaro's thinking, but it's fine, right? We we meant to give this back to Maple anyhow. I guess. Understood. Oh, I didn't want to do that. <gasps> Thank you, Sarah. Mwah, mwah. Uh, um, at any rate, please look after Kutaro for us. Oh, my is so sus. We can believe her, right? No, 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 ma'am. No, ma'am. Maybe we should try following her. Okay, let's go. Where else can she hide? Maple's room. Oh, poor girl. <gasps> Maya was headed this way, right? I don't see her anywhere. Something strange. Is there any way I can inspect? Oh, it's the lantern. The lantern. Show me your light. This school. Something showing up. Is this a picture of a school? This picture feels somehow familiar. Is it like in the gallery or something? <gasps> Here, skiol. Painting some scenery. There seems to be a picture of a school in the locker room too. Too high to check. What should we do? Hmm. Piggy. <gasps> Human pyramid. That's funny. A human pyramid. Can we treat it like a group gymnastics exercise? Uh, how many of us are you planning on roping in? Oh, no dice, huh? If KG were here, <laughs> KG, <laughs> he was so big. If KG were here, I could probably reach by piggybacking off of him. Uh, I'll put my hands on the wall. Get on my shoulders. Oh my god, he's jealous. Let's give it a try. Okay. Can we jump on him? Oh, we had to press him, maybe. His hands are on the wall. Squat down for me, then I'll get on. Heavy. Girl. What? Oh, I mean, oh, light. Oh, so light. So not heavy. Calm down. Don't get agitated. Let's see here. <gasps> it's a vent. The painting opened. Inside a switch labeled Secret Locker. What should we do? Press it, dog. Press the switch. Where did I go? Nothing's changed. Oh, I went back down. Is it for a different room? Ooh, wait, the locker room? Saucy. Wait, we should save. <gasps> Something's coming out of there. Wait, I wanted to save. Why? Why is it always you? Why is it always this man? Hmm? What brings you here? <laughs> Midori, what are you doing in there, huh? <gasps> Who can say? What kind of room is in there? You should just find that out for yourself. What now? Should we go in? Go inside. Wait, can I, can I save? I got save. This is a game where we have to save like 24-7. Okay, let's go. Let's go. I'm sassy. Girl, this is a lobotomy machine? Where everybody at? Answer. A bed illuminated by lights. It's like an operating table. Interesting. Lights. Shouldn't look directly at it. Is that it? I guess that's it. No time for that now. Wait, but there's... Oh, there's something here. Press the switch. Oh, look, a vending machine. Is that ramen? Lights came on. Yummy. Drink machine. Drinks again? Hey, these are all hot drinks. What's gotten you so excited? It doesn't seem to have any charging capabilities, which means it's no trouble if we drink from here. Connor's fine with cocoa. How about Sarah? Oh, hot chocolate. <gasps> Miso soup. I'll have some miso soup. White, miso black, miso red, miso, whatever they have. Um, they don't have any. This ain't a soup bar. This, it ain't no soup bar. Oh, um, well then, anything's fine. Relax just a little bit with the drink machine. Okay, are you done now? No time for that. Variety of tools, a door, <gasps> a switch. Mine must be in here, right? Hold on a second. Then why did Midori come out of here? 
No good. Knocking's not getting a response. What could this mean? Well, there's a switch, so let's press it. What? Wait, why does she think there's no more... There's not a point in looking around here? She's so saucy. But my might be in there. I think I'll go inspect the cemetery some more. Okay, weirdo. Even if Maple's out of commission, it'd still be dangerous to be alone, right? Said Mar Ranmaru, you come with me. Hmm. Why me? Here, you hold my cocoa. You're drinking way too much. She's gonna pee her pants. Can I press that switch? What should we do, Mia? Let's keep searching this floor some more for Keiji and Kyutaro. Not to say I doubt mine, but still, I do. Oh, I doubt her hardcore. Oh, that's a keyhole. I thought it was a switch. Let's go back here. Oh, we hear something now. <gasps> Fix his Sarah. Watch out. Well, Mark, we'll get hit with a rock. Oh, I got hit by a rock. <gasps> that was close, Mia. He saved my life. The ceiling fell. I wonder if it's because of Maple's rampage. Rocks. It was a close call. It has some weird smell like ink, meow. <gasps> Lantern. Show me the truth. Okay, debris has fallen. Wish I could read it. Wait, read. It's a handwritten message. It's pretty worn, but I can read it. Who that? This is farewell. I'll be departing this facility shortly. Of course, I feel a sense of responsibility for aiding a plan to restructure the criminal underworld. But deciding deaths by majority vote? I can no longer entertain this. Here on the sixth floor, there is an escape route known to no one. I commend you for finding this message. By all means, visit me and together we shall build the new underworld. Shinobu Goku! Wait, this is the person that, the, that was wanted. Shinobu Gokujo? <gasps> That's the name from that wanted poster, Mia. What do you mean? I explained the Hades incident. A mutual slaughter to decide the dawn of the seedy organization. You mean a death game? Yeah. <laughs> and this being written on the wall here. Means it took place here? Ain't this huge? If this is all true, there might still be an exit on floor six. What floor is this? This is floor five. It's an incredibly tiny hope. Could have long since been sealed off. Even it's still around, no telling whether we would find it. You know what, you're right, it is kinda sus because so far, no one's been telling us the truth. No one's been telling us the truth. But that ain't possible. There's hope of us getting home. Sarah. Oh, that hurts, Rico. My bad, I feel like I just had to hug you. Hope. The moment we saw that exit, it was all replaced with abject despair. Now I feel like I've seen the tiniest, tiniest sliver of light. And also, if what Mai says is true, even we can escape with you. <laughs> I wanna believe. Okay, let's go. Let's go knock down that Hinako. There she is. She's a little. Hey, Sarah. Has Kuramata contacted you at all? I forgot all about him. Kinda think of it, he hasn't. Let's check. Kuramata, do you hear me? Over. No reply. Wonder if he's moving around. Wonder if he's dead. No way. Let me have the transceiver for a bit. I'll go check on him and look for him if he's not there. Huh? Wait, I'm sussed. I'm tired of all this cocoa too. Hmm. Can I leave you to that? Of course. Hidden Ramaru the transceiver. You be careful now. Right. Wait, I'm sus. She's so sus. Okay, let's leave. It's back to floor five. Up, up. Up, up. How do I leave? I wanna go up, up. Hmm. <gasps> Where's Mabel? Mabel's gone. It can't be. Did she start up again? I think if she started up again, we would be able to hear it. 
it's this bad meow. The ID card's still with Baker Lady Wolf. If we meet her now, it'll be bad. Okay, so what you're saying is that we should run for our lives. What you doing? <gasps> Midori. Hey, if you got time on your hands, can you help me carry this? Meow? Maple? That's... Yep, Maple. Poor thing. Where are you gonna take her? Why, the operating room, of course. I'll fix her. With the power of my love. Like shit, you will. We won't let you. Huh? You don't want Mabel to be brought back? Oh, this poor girl. That ain't it. I know you're just gonna make her suffer again. <laughs> By the power of his love. If you wanna stop me, then kill me. Not that I expect anyone but Maple would be able to do that. Okay, stand aside. I'm on my way to the operating room. Shit, what do we do about this? Why, why can't he be normal for once? Also, I can't believe he stole Maple. She likes him. Let's go in here. The operating room. I can hear Midori's laughter and the clattering of tools from inside. What should we do? Can't we stop him somehow? Something terrible is happening before us, yet I can't do anything. Wait, you're letting Mabel become... Operated? Keiji, what should I do? You know what? I think your handsome policeman is dead. Testing, testing. Can you hear me? Huh? It's your friendly policeman on the air. How's everybody doing? Oh my god, he's alive! Love is still real. What? What is this? Would love to explain everything, but unfortunately, there's no time. If you can hear my voice, I've got a request for you. Bring the ID card to the classroom. I don't have it. I need Sarah to do it, and for her to come alone. Wait, that's kind of weird. Counting on you. I feel like it's a voice recording, but also I don't have the ID card. That was... Keiji's voice, right? It sure was, but... <gasps> Mr. Policeman! So he was okay, Mia. B b but is he really? <gasps> Woof, why are you downing it, bucket girl? <gasps> it's, it's just strange. Why have Sarah bring the ID card all by herself? <gasps> Meow. But then, who else could have done this, ma? That's true. Midori's right here. We need to get that ID card stat. Where did my go? What a troublesome situation. Here's the ID card back, Sarah. Oh, wait, that was easy. My. So you weren't in there? Wait, that's so weird. What was she doing? Huh? I was outside. Anyway, a suspicious announcement. You're going to see what it's all about, right? I'll keep guard here so the rest of you go together. Wait, that was way too easy. Right, I'm not going to let Sarah end up in danger. Good luck, everyone. This feels... Strange. Something's odd with my... Go with the others. All right, let's head there together. Yeah, I'll see you guys in the elevator. Wait, that's so sus. Wait, this is actually so sus. Let's, let's save. Okay, let's go. All right, everyone, get on quickly. This is definitely strange. Are we sure this isn't a trap to get us all where they want us? <gasps> Why do you say that? Believe in Keiji. We could always not go. We ain't found Kyutaro either. I told you, Kyutaro's doing just fine. Really now. I'm sorry, everyone. I got in the elevator by myself. <gasps> no, girl, you gonna die. Sarah, I swear, I'll be back quick. No matter how suspicious it is, if I can find something about Keiji, I want to know. Even if it's the worst possible answer. No, she's about to die. This is not, is not okay. So the classroom. <clears throat> okay, let's save again. Okay, the classroom, she says. 
Keiji? Where are you at? Keiji? There's no one here. Show yourself. Show yourself. And define. Oh, there's a sound near the teaching podium. Is someone hiding behind there? Approach, girl. We are not in a horror movie. Give me courage, God. Here we go. <laughs> what the? Keiji? Keiji? Don't come here, Sarah. Keiji? What? Wait, what? What's happening? Is that Keiji? Hi, Crooked Gamer. How are you? We're... I don't know how far I am <clears throat> to even, like, finishing this chapter of your turn to die. I have to talk to him. Okay. Keiji, if you love me, please say something. That voice, it's its you, isn't it, Keiji? Stay away. Okay, my fault. Keiji, do you hear my voice? Are you the one who called for me? Are you the one I've been waiting for all of my life? Listen to me. If you survived, then why? Don't come over here. Sarah. Oh. What's that yellow? A sharp pain runs through my body. K. G. Sarah. I think the last thing I saw was his biceps. Oh, <gasps> was his pecs. Was Keiji's face. Thank you, he's alive. Oh, what's that? Sometime earlier. <gasps> oh, we're gonna find out what happened. Wait, he got out? Yo, how you feeling? <gasps> My man. My man, Q Taro. You got a pretty pain look there. At least give me a reply, KG. Morning. Ooh, my head's still spinning. Glad you're okay. Can you stand? Wait, I love this little, um, detail. The little data thing changed to Keiji's face because we're on his paw right now. Okay, I'm all right. Hey, you look pretty drained. Are you okay? Nah, no problems here. Appreciate the concern. Just not the most expressive guy, I guess. Now gotta wake up and assess the situation. Okay. Still looking a little woozy, Keiji. Where's Sarah? Where's Sarah? Where's Sarah and the others now? They got an ID card and went up to the upper floor. Seems like the coffin control system worked out. Oh, so it did work. Wait, then how did they all close again? Glad you didn't have to get grilled. No kidding. Well, that's a relief. So everybody's okay. Also, I can't get over how cute Mai is, but she's just so sussy. And also, I never realized that this was a bread until um, until Jin said that little bakery lady. And well, about that, Kuromata took a big injury and Maple still run wild on this floor. What? I'm impressed you two are okay. <laughs> well, we weathered it out hiding in the coffins. But if they had gotten locked, then we just have Sarah and the gang unlock them for us, right? I see. But we can't hide here forever. Yep. I want to meet back up with the rest. I'm sure they're gonna cry. We gotta hurry upstairs. Thing is, if Mabel comes running after us, everybody will be in danger. But then, then what should we do? I've got an idea. We turn the power off so Mabel can't use the elevator. Okay. He's doing something? Y you mean the breaker in the gallery? But then we'll be stranded. Come on now. We've got this heavy shutter here. We'll be safe, all right? I'm guessing it's gotta be Sarah and the others who closed it from the control room. That being the case. Hey, somebody open up the shutter. Kutara waved to give a signal, but nothing happened. Girl, there ain't, ain't no one looking at you. Hmm, nobody watching? Are we stuck here? 
For now, let's think of a way out of here. Yeah, can't stand just sit still. And here I thought Kyotaro was cooking hard. Like I thought he had something up his sleeve, but he did not. He had nothing. Let's take a careful look around. Okay. The coffin I was just in earlier. Hmm? There's writing inside. It reads from left to right, one, two, three, seven, six, five, four. Okay, so one, two, three, seven, six, five, four. Okay. It's a little too dark to notice this when I was in it. So I guess one, two, three. This one's four? Or is it one, two, three, four, five, six, seven? One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. I don't know. Okay. Coffin. Oh, okay. Think about it. Made mysterious numbers from one to seven. Come to think of it, there's seven coffins too. We're like closing them now. Coffin Hinako was in. Oh. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. We know this is seven. So I don't know if it's one, two, three, one, two, three, one, or one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's just try this. One, two, three, four. Oh, JK. So it is the other way around. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now what? Oh. Oh? Keiji, look. This wall moved. Seems like it'll open if we push it. A door? My push the wall. So it connected to here. Also, isn't Maple running around rampaging? Are we not about to die? <gasps> Hooray! We got out. I have to go straight to floor five, but let's go shut off the power to the elevator. Okay. Where's the gallery? Here we go. Then this. Turn this off. Okay, break her off. That ought to keep Maple from going upstairs. Should we return to the cemetery? Right, before she finds us. Oh, she found us. Somebody's coming. Hide. Here we go. Ooh. Maple? <gasps> oh, is that Maple? She's so sweet. What are we gonna do? Wait, why is she, she dead? Ooh. She's acting strange. Hey, girl. We approached Maple. <gasps> okay, she... Kyutaro, my, don't come near me. I'll do something terrible to you. It's all right. Lifted up Maple. H hey, Keiji? See, I won't put a scratch on you. You're kind. Seems like we'll be able to talk peacefully. Wait, that's so sad. I did terrible things to everyone. It's because we stole Midori's ID card from you, right? Hey, do you really like him that much? Yeah, but I have to kill him. Ooh. Wait, I wonder if he knows this, and that's why he's operating on her, like to remove him. That part of her brain or something? Huh? The obstructors are tasked with killing everyone other than the human survivors. Wait, I didn't know that. I thought they were supposed to kill, like, them. But they're actually here to kill the dolls and then Midori. My target was the one in the number four coffin. Which was Hiyori. Oh! So then, you're actually on our side? Right, I am. But Hiyori put an obstacle in the way. A love program. Oh, I was configured to love Hiyori. Configured? That's why I can't kill him. But if you all can end this love, I could become a weapon to kill him. This is my gimmick. What's that nonsense? Your feelings are being treated like some game mechanic? Yeah, wait, that's so sad. 
but this feeling was a happy one. Far more so than Hiyori anticipated. That's why you went on a rampage? I'm sorry. Ugh. There's no time. Hey, stay with us here. In, in the locker room, check the center one on the left side. And that's the, um, it's this picture. Oh, just kidding, something else. This password is 3141. Once you have what's inside, come back here. I wonder what it is. We'll be back. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go to the locker room. We have to find something. All right, let's go. 3141. Which one? This one? Okay, let's go. Oh, the lantern. Okay. So now we can go back. Are we using this on her? Or what are we using it on? Oh, that changed color? Oh, that's anything. Hey, Maple. Hiyori. Whoa, easy now, little lady. Hiyori. No use. She doesn't notice us. I is she broken? Maple told us to come back once we obtained this lantern. Maybe she wanted us to inspect this room. Okay, cool. Then what I did was right then. Okay, so let's click on this this thing right here. Okay. Painting looks different. Let's give her a look-see. Can you reach though? I'm gonna jump. Oh my lord, he jumps high. Whoa, amazing stuff. Ow! Kitaro, you opened up your wound. Uh, sorry. But there's a switch behind that painting. I'll jump up. Oh. And then he pressed the switch. Wait, that was to, um... The elevator? I don't even remember. Okay. I think it was the elevators, right? No? Is something else? Oh, it was the operating table. That's right, that's right, that's right, that's right. Okay. Hey, let's check it out. I want to know what Maple wanted to tell us. True, let's go. Well then, let's head in. It's operating table. Nothing. Some kind of switch. Press switch. <gasps> Who is that? Who is that? You can't give me like a new character this far into the game. Like I'm so confused. Who is that? Who are you? Was that a figment of my imagination? What's the matter? Oh, nothing. You know, business as usual. Okay. Okay. Big box labeled repaired. Hmm? Open it up. Oh my lord. I was about to make a joke. There's probably someone's body parts in here, but I couldn't do it fast enough, and there is a body part in here. A suffered head? It's Midori's. Nah, just a doll head. Okay. The box got a letter in it. <gasps> Hello, overloaded. That's a head. Yep, that's head. <laughs> How are you? Let's see. To Master Hiyori, forgive the delay. The left eye and surrounding area have been repaired. Once charged, it should function properly. From who? This is some messy writing. What's up with this? A spare doll? Hmm, I want it. Maybe we should take this. You serious? Could be used for something after all. <gasps> we have a head. Yay, look, his head. Okay, now let's go somewhere else. Let's uh, go to the elevators. Nothing? <gasps> Wait, how's your animation going? Is it going well? You're almost done? He's muttering Hiyori to herself. Well, I got it uh, for you. Hey, Maple. Here's Hiyori. <gasps> Hiyori's here. I'm glad. That's so sad. Thank you. So you found the lantern. How can we fix you? It's impossible. Never mind that. Listen. I'll tell you about the banquet. 
Super well, it's super odd. Oh, it's super odd and you super, well, that's good. <gasps> that's good. Wait, I also made a ton of new things. Nothing animation wise, because I don't know how to animate, but I made new overlays. Um, a new BRB screen. I made a new chatting screen, but I can't reveal any of it until my um, 3.0 debut, I sadly. Banquet? The banquet is the last resort of this sub game. It's the only way to clear it. Was it? It was written on that big gate. When the dead assemble, the banquet shall begin. Does that have to do with the dummies? You're half right, but no. It's the coffins. Made a new transition? <gasps> I want to learn how to make one of those, but I don't know how to. I think it has to do with animation, and if it does, then I do not know how to. Which is sad. So I really want to make my new, like, my own stinger. There are seven coffins in the cemetery. And there are seven people in them once more. The banquet will be held. Wait, are there enough dolls? We got my no we don't. We got Mai, Anzu, Ranmaru, Hinako, um Kurumada Mai, Ranmaru, Hinako, Kurumada, Hay Hayasaka's dead. Um Wait, is that it? Yeah, that's it. There's not enough dolls. By doing that, even the dummies can be saved. How does that work? I mean, we have to kill our partners. Did you really hear that? What? Haha, <laughs> and if you don't want to go back to being a corpse, then before the game ends, have the one you're paired with take your place. Take my place? Simply make her into a corpse instead. Kill your partner. Someone to take your place. Your true mission was to create substitutes for yourself. <gasps> Wait, we create dolls of ourselves? Killing them just means putting them in your coffin. Anyone will do. Doll or human, dead or alive. Where has the algorithm taken me this time? <laughs> Hello, Erudan. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome. Thank you. Um, hi, I am Prim, idol VTuber. I love to play horror games, visual novels, and um, I like anime boys. Welcome. This is where the algorithm has taken you. Uh, well, uh, thank you or sorry for your lost. Well, I don't know. <gasps> That's all it takes. What in the world? There was never any reason for us to fight with the dummies. And the dummies done stabbed Kyutaro. If you clear the game, the collar bombs will stop. Then, what about running out of power? If we run out of battery, we die, right? Would they still charge us after we clear it? Okay, so what I don't understand is that they know they're dummies. They, like anime boys, a little too much. Extra note in there. Okay, but like, that's normal. Don't, if you love something, shouldn't you express your love? You know? Okay, anyway, like these dolls, they know they're not real. So why do they want to live so bad? Like, for me personally, if I woke up one day and I knew it was a doll, it's over. I would find a way to kill myself. I don't know. Hiyori might not think of me or you as anything more than gimmicks. No! But you see, Mai, you'll just stop. Your body will remain. There's a possibility you can be brought back. Th there's just no way, right? Who's gonna bring us back? There's no way Asunaru will show us sympathy. They intend to dispose of us from the start. They've just been enjoying watching us struggle helplessly. We'll bring you back. I don't know how yet, but we ain't gonna abandon you. Not a chance. Wait, does he like her? Cute, her. Wait, do they like each other? We're allies after all. <gasps> well, a good answer, he said. <laughs> it's okay. You have allies. Don't be scared. How nice seeing you three. I feel like I... Mabel! Oh, she did. Oh, she did. Hey, Mabel. Damn it. Did she die? Oh, no, we'll bring her back. We'll bring her back. We'll bring her back. Her body's still here, too. 
There's still the possibility. Okay, can I have my head back? What's this? Something fell to the floor. A small key. <gasps> Wait, we can go in that room. Was Mabel holding this? Wait, can I have the head back? Mabel holds Hiro's head. Oh, I can't. But we can go back to here. Okie dokie. Now we can use this key. Looks like we can use the key Mabel had. Oh, I don't like that noise. <gasps> All right, it unlocked it. Okay, let's go. Should I have saved? Saffalin? What's she doing here? I see a person silhouette. <gasps> Who's there? <gasps> oh no. You, if it ain't Saffalin. Is that someone's stomach? <gasps> I'm, I'm not your enemy this time. Please don't hit me. I won't. I'm just gonna ask a few questions. <gasps> Whoa. Hi, girl. <laughs> what do you want from me? She's on guard. <laughs> Loosen the mood, tell a joke. Uh, hey, Saffalin. W when does Snoop Dogg use an umbrella? Faux drizzle. It's all right. We aren't gonna do a thing. <laughs> You're so suspicious. I get that a lot. I was just asked to do maintenance by someone, that's all. Midori, I bet. M Midori. So that's what you call him. Maintenance. For this machine in the center? Uh, oh. uh, I won't tell you. I won't show respect to the enemy. Wait, I thought we weren't enemies. Bingo. How dubious. Let's check this machine out. This thing right here? It looks like a human cocoon. What's this? It looks like a capsule. Doesn't budge when I touch it. What's this? What's this? Can we click on anything? Confusing the machine. <gasps> Try hitting it. <gasps> oh, please don't be rough with it. Then tell us about it already. Uh, understood. Please watch. <gasps> Fan service. Who is that? Kiyori? Wait, but I got the head. The hell's this? <gasps> There's a headless Midori inside. A doll body? That's right. It was in my room. Where? Where? Is that room connected to this one? C could this machine be the machine that birthed us? Oh, girl, don't say it like that. Yes, it's called the AI Seaver. AI Seaver? You just put a doll inside and select an AI. We get about three minutes. It'll ding and it's done. Oh, like an oven. Oh, like a microwave. It sounds like a microwave. <gasps> That's not funny. What are our lives? Are they that trivial? Hey, Saffalin. Why are you doing maintenance on this? Because I heard it'll be useful in the banquet. I suppose you intend to go through with that terrifying thing. Wait, this like banquet that they're alluding to was actually so creepy like what is actually going on it is so creepy but, but but please be at ease i don't have the doll's head or the id card so i can't do any more than this so please don't bully me hmm well we know where the head is so should we go grab the head then um Q Taro, you look pained are you injured? Uh, I'm all right. Um, I, I can examine you. Better not. Better not. She's our enemy after all. But uh, you really look like you're in pain. I don't think um, someone that wants to help us would smile like that. That's very creepy. Sorry, I'll stay and get treated for a bit. What? Honestly, it's been pretty rough. Has it now? <gasps> Leave it to us. You rest up, cute Taro. Wait, so this is where he was? Where Maya was like, oh yeah, like he's. Let's go grab the head. Can we grab it? You know he's head. Sorry, Maple. Uh, are, are you sure? I, f I feel kind of bad. Midori's an evil man. He's not a good fit for Maple. 
Well, okay. Come on, let's go back. You're worried about Kyutaro, right? Yeah. If he's oogling her, I'll never stand for it. That's her concern? Oh my god, that's so real. Okay, let's go back. Where was it again? L locker? Locker? I already forgot. Here? Oh yes, and then back here. Back here. That's right. Okay. Where'd they go? Why did I think they would still be in there? Huh? Kyutaro and Saflin aren't here. <gasps> Where'd you go? Kyutaro? Are they in the back? Back aware. Back aware, dog. <gasps> that looks like it hurts. That's quite a deep wound. Who did that? Um, me? Wait, where are they again? Machine to activate the AI receiver. Wait, we don't have the ID card. We put the head on. Attach head? Attach head. <gasps> okay, so I'm confused why we had to do that because we know that he is going to kill us. Will this do? I suppose it wouldn't move, huh? Glad it's just at all. But what does this have to do with the banquet? My guess is to fill the seven coffins. The coffin Midori was in can't be left empty either. Oh, so this doll will be his substitute. That's right, but wait. So remember how like we came in here when we were Sarah and then we saw like the doll? Does Do both dolls like move independently of each other? Maybe even without this thing, we can have somebody substitute. What are you doing? So you all really intend to do the banquet? Uh, I mean, isn't the banquet the only way we can clear the game with everyone alive? It's nothing so kind. It's the most awful game. You'll be killed. Someone will absolutely. N no way. That, that's not what we heard. Ma Maple said. At any rate, don't get in the coffins. Oh, who do we trust? Do we trust Maple? I kind of trust Maple more than Safflin because Safflin seems like she has no like backbone. What's happening right now? Okay, so basically we ran into Safflin again from um chapter two. Yeah, from chapter two, and she now now she's telling us that we're not supposed to get in the coffins, even though Maple said yeah everybody need to get in. What's going on? Is there any other way, Safflin? Well, if we do nothing, the dummies call us will explode. If that helps the odds of saving them even a little, we gotta do it. In that case, please at least do this. As much as possible, try to keep it a secret who's in the coffins. Their surveillance system is disabled currently. Now is your chance. Even obscuring just one person will help. That's a tough request. Let's use the Midori doll. <gasps> Let's disguise ourselves. Let's use it all. How about this then? We put the Midori doll in the coffin. Boop. Okay, and then I'll hide in a room somewhere. Okay. The Mi then Midori won't see me anywhere, and so he'll think Heiji's inside, right? <gasps> Wait, this is the secret. I see, a deceptive maneuver. Why would you willingly dress up as food for the plot? <laughs> How interesting. But, but, there's one more thing you need. It's, it's what? It's what? Oh my god. This is like whenever um Gojo killed Ghetto and then he whispered something into his ear and then we don't know what it is. Oh, I see. Yes, I imagine it'll be different. No worries. I can arrange for that. <gasps> really? Yep. Now let's assemble everything we need. And if we, and if we give the Midori doll a personality with the AI Seaver, we'll have a perfect substitute ready to go. Our deception plan should work. Right, Safflin? Um, there's still one other important thing. That doll head is out of battery. We'll put some in. It's gonna have power too. Talk about short-lived celebration. But if you use the charger on floor five. For real? You got one of those? All right. I'm sure the others will bring us the ID card. So we can just charge this head. Let's do it. There's no other reason to suspect everything. It's scary, but I've never felt such optimism. 
Hope. Sure is important. Please be careful. If you need treatment, come back here. Okay, let's go put somebody. Oh, where are we going? Hey, Keiji. Sorry, but could you drop by the cemetery? Okay. All right. That's sussy. That's sussy. Oh, let me sit myself down for a sec. What's wrong, dog? What's wrong, dog? Wait, can we see into his inner being? Wait, what happened? That was weird. Why did they all change color? Wait, what? Hayasaka was in the room? Keiji, but I planned from earlier. Right? The deception using Midori's doll. To fool the enemy, first deceive your allies. Keiji, could we make it seem like you got executed in the coffin? Okay. <gasps> what are you saying? Kyutaro. Okay. I'm game. What's this plan look like, Kyutaro? <gasps> you too, Keiji? It's simple, I tell you. We put the dolls lying in coffins and wait till the execution device starts. Keiji, you go up above and charge the head. When you come back, use the AI Seaver to make another Midori. Then just swap what's inside the coffins, and you can vanish, Keiji. <gasps> Stop it. I feel bad for Sarah and everyone. Yeah, they just opened up the lid, right? They couldn't even do it. <gasps> Hi, Bubba. Happy Friday. TGIF and such. How are you? How's your day? How's been your Friday? That's obviously not what I mean. We'll make something happen for the lid. What? Keiji, now be a good time to use that lantern you got. Yes, sir. You see, they changed color. Uh-huh. The material is going to let us pull the trick. Did he hear something from Safflin? Wait, why does Kyotaro have so much riz that all these dolls are just giving him, like, clues? <gasps> you got off work? Good job. Chilling to a prim stream. Yeah. Even though this is my, um, my first stream this whole week and it's Friday. Hee <laughs> hee. Tee hee, pedal. But even if we lock the lid, how do you intend to get to the upper floor without anyone noticing? I feel like I've studied so much for my boards that I'm at that point where I'm like, okay, whatever. Like, just, just let me take it. I don't even care anymore. I got a plan. A way to send Keiji to the upper floor alone. Cute, Toro. <laughs> I want to meet the others. I wish I could see the others soon. Others, Astrich. Astrich. Astrich? I don't know how to pronounce that word. Uh, Sarah. You can meet him when this is all over. He's got no intention of giving this up. Okie dokie. I'll buy it. Fine, I'll do it too. Once we've pulled this off, we have to give everyone an apology. Alright, once you're ready, give me a holler. I'll give you the detail plan then. Wait, I wanted to use this on him. I'm gonna save real quick. Can we use it on him? <gasps> use lantern. Kyutaro! Memory time! <gasps> Guess you'd be one for police questioning, huh? Let's go! But well, guess it's as good as time as any. Let's give it one last go. <gasps> I wanted to know his past. But even though he's just a baseball player. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna take a drink break. He had a girlfriend? What's going on? The memory I'm wondering about was when I was in the hospital. I told you when we met that I got injured and couldn't play baseball for a while, right? Never really looked back on that time, thinking it was in the past. But now it's a real unclear memory, and it just feels like there's more to it. Okay, let's see. Okay, let's start at the top like we always do. Um, trees? Curtain? Okay, go over. Okay, okay. House? Okay, okay. <gasps> not that being Hiyori. That's not even his girlfriend. It's Hiyori. I'm so done right now. He's everywhere. The little green dude is everywhere. You know baseball? He's in a wheelchair. Okay, did he break his leg? Like his ligament or something? TV's not on. And there's this weird thing right there. Oh, that's his wheelchair. Okay, let's start with the baseball then. Right, that, huh? 
Think I might have remembered something. That ornament. Actually, I threw it out. It was a gift from a supporter, but... <gasps> what? A fan gave that to you and you threw it away? It was painful to leave it out. Can't hide nothing from you, can I? You got it in one. Wanted anything to do with baseball out of sight. So I tossed it and just pretended I'd forgotten. Then and now, I'm a weak person. Only a strong person can admit they're weak. Hashtag deep. Okie dokie, let's lean out of the wheelchair. Could you remember this part some more? Yup, it was a wooden chair. Come to think of it though, that can't be it. It was much comfier than that. Comfier? That's right, because <gasps> it was a wheelchair. I completely forgot. My leg injury is worse than I thought. Seems like it takes some time to treat. Yeah, a fatally long time for a second string player itching to go back into pro baseball. I've always wanted to hit a baseball with a baseball bat. But I feel like I would get hit by the baseball instead. He must have been feeling awfully impatient. Okay, what, what's next? Hiyori, I'm going to skip that for now because he's a creep. And then go to this baseball on TV. Okay. You got it. The TV. Yeah, I got an idea about that. It's a little embarrassing, but... I couldn't watch TV no more. Huh? Why is that? Too much Major League Baseball? When I turned on the TV, like it or not, there'd be news programs going. And I'd catch some side of some baseball news. It wasn't TV you couldn't watch, but ba I wonder if he was like, like I know he was a baseball player, but was he like, like amazing? Like was he like, who was a baseball player? Babe Ruth? I have no idea. Was he like that? I'm heartless, I swear. Can't even cheer for my teammates. I'm watching baseball, it was pure suffering. Uh, I get how you feel. Bet you can't watch detective shows no more either. I don't, I don't know about that one, chief. Sure. Guess we'll say that. Around that time, I was thinking about death a lot more than baseball. Oh. Cue Taro. Don't go tell nobody. Oh, that's so sad. And now here we go to this freak. He has no consent form for him, though. It's weird. Okay. Oh, it's a nurse. I thought it was his girlfriend. Could you remember this person some more? Yeah, I think that lady was... Huh? No, hold on, it was a man. He was a fair bit taller than that, and also... His face. That's right. He had the same face as Midori. That ain't possible. You telling me I met Midori there? S -s Stay calm. Are you sure of that? Yeah. Now that I think about it, it's gotta be. I met Midori and talked with him. Feels like we discussed my retirement. You were able to open up to him? You got it. That's just so weird. I can't, why? Why is Midori like this? Retirement? Was his leg injury that serious? That's so sad. Wait, did I miss something? The bed? The bed? Is it the bed? Oh, the bed was normal. Oh, wait. Oh, no, wait. I'm, I'm misremembering a little. I had them lower the height of the bed. Since I'm so big, I was risking falling off. Truly a giant. It ain't a laughing matter. If a leg injury worsens, that's deadly for a player's career. I couldn't let the guys at the orphanage hear that I retired because I fell out of bed. Could be a funny headline. Keiji, you gonna take this seriously or what? But nothing like that happened, and you were discharged from the hospital just fine, right? Kyuzaru? Yeah, should be. Wait, I'm missing something? What, what am I missing? Okay, we got that. Is it him? <gasps> His eyeball? Wait, what happened? That's a weird question, but let's see. Come to think of it, something was different. Now, what was it? <gasps> Back then I had... Bandages. There were bandages wrapped around my head. That ain't right. Was it not just my leg that got injured? Was your head injured too? No. My eyes. 
I nearly lost all my eyesight then. What's going on? If that's true, what can I see now? Dang, Midori performing miracles? Maybe your treatment or surgeries went well? Then why have I got no memory of that? Um, if they were erased, that's quite a mystery. I want to remember everything. Quick. Wait, I'm still missing something? No way. What is this? So there's the bed. Got that. I got that. I got him. I always start, like, expecting Midori just to start moving. Because he's just so weird. Okay, there he is. We got the flowers. Is that this house? Wait, what am I missing? This little focal point is just so tiny. Oh, it is this thing. Wait, what? What is it significant about? The curtain? You just take interest in the weirdest places, huh? And nothing of interest there? No, wait. There was. I think the curtain. It was half closed so that you couldn't see from the other room. That room had kids in it, see? And they were baseball lovers. And deep enough to even know about me. Okay, so I guess he wasn't like crazy famous. To children, athletes are like superheroes. That's right. You understand, don't you? I couldn't let those six kids in the hospital see me like this. He didn't even want them to see their hero discouraged. That's deep. I remember it. The whole thing. My memory looked like this. I took a major injury that threatened my career. If I got it during practice, that'd be one thing. But it was a careless, unrelated accident. Wait, how? This whole time I thought that he got injured in like a game. Stuck in a hospital room, I worried day after day. Then, that nurse came along. Should I just die? No. I got no value left. I'd be better off dying, I'll tell you. It's all right. You'll be back on the field soon. How long that's gonna take? Days? Months? No. A year? Oh my god, he's huge! How can I play baseball with these eyes and these legs? I apologize. Sorry. Just quit trying to console me. You suck at it. There's a way. Huh? Oh my god, you know what Midori's like? Midori's that meme of that friend that's had every single job like in existence. Do you know the Asunaro vow? If you sign your name on a certain form, you can have any wish granted. I ain't gonna believe some silly pop dream. Well, that's just the official story. Rumor has it you, you can be given experimental illegal treatments. Also, this is the real world. If someone came up to me and then said, um, hey man, you want this? How would I know? How, like no it's, it's more like it's not real like what do you mean like what do you mean but if you're just gonna die otherwise what do you think in truth i have one of the forms here he just so conveniently had one i'll leave it here for you mr kyutaro a silly pop dream he literally is like where's waldo but ain't my life always been chasing dreams chasing dreams that's sad. My eyes, my legs, I didn't even get them through above board means. There were compensation for signing that form. <gasps> Wait, that's crazy. This was Q-Taro's erased memory. Damn, man, what kind of athlete am I? <laughs> what kind of ace am I? I never really believed in playing fair from the start, did I? That's sad. That's so sad. Poor Q-Taro. Let's save. Let's move on with our life. Kyutaro. Wait, can we look at this real quick? So it was Hinako, Ranmaru, Kuromaza, Mai, Anzu, Hayasaka, and Hiyori. So we're just missing, um, what's it called? Midori. We're, we're, we're missing Hayasaka because he's not alive anymore. But that's crazy. What's going to happen then? I should have saved him. I can't believe he's the only one that's been dead. All right, let's do it. Okay, let's go! And so, me and Mal here support Keiji from the lower floor. Okay. I'll go to the upper floor and charge up Midori's head. Time to start. Don't you dare get seen, Keiji. Okay, that's crazy. How did he do all that and not get seen? I need to go to the elevator. Okay, let's go. 
And then let's go up, 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 up. <gasps> Good luck with your animation. Thanks for stopping by. Okay, let's go. From the elevator. So you'll go up the other elevator. Oh, okay, so this one. Oh, we're here for now. Kyoto and Mai can decide the timing. So when? Oh, here we go. Okay, I was like, what the heck? <gasps> let's go, fifth floor. Okay. Let's go. Press the button, the elevator started moving. Okay, let's go charge now. That is in the back of here. Wait, I need to, I should probably save. <gasps> oh, he gonna see me? What's going on? Is he alive? Oh, he's dead. He's dead, okay, let's charge. You look like you're seeing a corpse. <gasps> you're alive. Uh, and whose fault do you think it is I'm like this? Looks painful. Looks real painful. You dumbass. So like, why are you all here by yourself? What about Mai? You seen her? She's safe. She's down below. Oh yeah? Then I guess we'll meet up. Where's everybody else? They're all headed down. It's just me here. Of course, I might be at my limit soon. Just Kurumata? Tell him about the banquet. I, he don't even know. Okay. <gasps> okay, I was like, I don't think I can like talk for a whole banquet thing. So let's, let's, let's do this. Okay, let's charge the head now. If we can save even a single person, we gotta take that bet. Okay, you. Since when are you so considerate of your ally? Oh, shut up. Well, whatever, I'm feeling good. I'll tell you this too. If a floor master meets their doppelganger, they die. <gasps> well, that's crazy. Wait, so if I take this Midori doll and stick it in front of Midori, he dies? What's up? N nothing be grateful because that was the only info I had. Wait, I thought I knew that then. Didn't he tell us that? This isn't good. Now I can't tell him about Midori's head. Wow, wow, wow. What's this? Papers. Do it. Isn't that like the real thing? Like if we were to be our doppelganger too, we would die? That's a charge. To think it's so huge, but only has w enough for one charge. One full charge. What does he know that? Don't tell me. You used it? Yeah. <gasps> Only half though. What? You think I'd hoard all of it for myself? Shit. Okay, my bad. There's still half. Okay, can I use it now? Can these tell me anything? Okay, so can we use it? I know, I thought he used all of it. I thought we used all of it to heal his little hole in his body. Okay, let's do it. Connect it. No choice. Huh? Hey, that's... Ain't that Midori's head? Did you kill him? Wrong. This is a doll head, first and foremost. And... Don't screw with me. Then why are you spending precious battery on that thing? I just gotta explain it. Calm down, dog. I'll explain. Literally, come on. Like, you think I'm taking all that? We're gonna... My sister asked me today. He was, she was like... What does glutton mean? I told her, glutton is um, whenever you have your pizza in the oven waiting to be done and you're looking around for more snacks. Well, that don't make any damn sense. <gasps> oh, oh my lordy, what is happening? What's going on? Why is he crawling? Why is he doing that? That's creepy. If you make another damn Midori, ain't that making a doppelganger? Grandma calls closer. What should I do? Step on him, step on him. Like a bug, like a cockroach. You're trying to kill Midori, aren't you? Didn't we save you? Even my wounds are because of you. And yet you're gonna forsake us. <gasps> no. This is just for the banquet. I know. That's gotta be a lie. <gasps> Listen to me. Stop that right now, you little cockroach. <gasps> Quit it. Get away. You traitor. <gasps> KG. Oh my god, this is his little thingy. His, uh, his delusion. You gonna kill me again? Th 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 that's wrong. No, it's not. You can't save anyone. I... 
All that matters to you is yourself. D don't touch me. Murder. I said don't touch me. Oh. Okay, so he stepped on him like a cockroach. Are you good? Oh, did I kill you? Please, Keiji. Don't forsake them. Please. <gasps> he's crying for his friends. Oh, he's such a bro. I won't forsake anyone. Don't worry. Let's go. Peace out. Goodbye. Goodbye. Uh, yeah, I think he like flipped out and then took him out. I think that's what happened. Let's go. Wait, he said. He wait. That means he didn't say this. <gasps> testing, testing. Can you hear me? Huh? It's your friendly. Wait till we know that this is not him now. What? That's crazy. Wait, so if he didn't say that, who did Sarah see in the classroom? What the hell was that? That was my voice. Damn it, what do I do? Um. Can we go to the classroom? Wait, so it, it was so it was his voice. No, no, no. So it was him then. It was a doll. But then, is that him hiding? What in the world's going on? Oh, <gasps> then we ran into Sarah. Wait, thanks, Sarah. Who are you, dog? How do you feel, KJ? R Ron Maru. You make that broadcast? Yep. Found a nice voice. Change your function. Oh, so it was a doll. Well, now you're right. You're right, Flash. You got some business with me? I might. Hand over Midori's head. What a sneaky little rat. Not seeing where you're going with this. I heard it all over the transceiver. You killed Kurumata Keiji. <laughs> I didn't kill him. I didn't kill him. I didn't kill him. I trusted you. Sarah too. She trusted you the most. Not him bringing up my little girlfriend i know right isn't that crazy i didn't think that it was him of all dolls so i thought it was midori but look at you with scrutiny and it's all clear keishi you you're with asunaru aren't you wait why is his heart beating why is his heart beating hey wait i don't get what you mean sarah she she's signed the consent form she was brought here by someone's wish. Put into a desperate situation for someone's sake. And at last, she signed the invitation. Keiji, are you the one who brought Sarah here? Wait, this is crazy. Unthinkable dog. Inconceivable even. That's unthinkable. No way I do that. Ron Maru. Buddy, this is just jealousy. You just want to be the closest to her, the one who protects her. Isn't that right? No, I don't matter in this. I just want to help Sarah. You can't be that person. Not you as a doll, or me as a murderer. Of course I know that. Now come on, hand over Midori's head. Wait, somebody's coming. Wait, this is when she comes. Wait, this is crazy. Hide. Keishi? There's no one here. <gasps> Why'd Sarah come? What are you planning? I remember I had out his left hand. <gasps> Not the mist, that's actually crazy. What's this? Keishi, are you there? Don't come here, Sarah. That voice, it's you, isn't it, Keishi? Stay away. Okay, so we we know this. Okay, we know this. Wait, why is she get zapped? Sarah? Stay with us, Sarah. I know, he steamed up his room with like his ultimate steamer hand. Oh my god, look at that little bandaged hand. Wait, why did he shock me too? Wait, why did I get zapped? Time to lock you away. Oh, so it's like that. So it's like this. 
So it's like this. So he wants me to die. <gasps> Wait, I'm back at Sarah. Where am I? You okay? <gasps> you come too, Sarah. I know, Ron Mara took Keiji and ran off. Now, I know, literally, we should've killed them. We should've killed that little mushroom headed boy. Huh? k k, -k Kyutaro? You're safe. Oh, I'm so re Oh. Hey, hey, don't overdo it getting up. Yeah, cause you were passed out, girl. <gasps> Big sis, Sarah. You want water, Mia? I see. I lost consciousness from some kind of electric shock. Normally we got a taser on him? Thank goodness. If you hadn't regained consciousness. Kana. That's right, where's the ID card? <gasps> I'll see it anywhere. Nothing we can do about it. But still, you got to meet back up with Kyutaro, so don't be sad. My. Then where's Keiji? <gasps> he wasn't anywhere, Mia. What? We just found you collapsed in the classroom all by yourself. This is so saucy. But we found something incredible, Sarah. The banquet. A way we can clear this game, surviving with the dummies. Banquet? Musa Gorilla knows all about it, Wolf. Yeah, which is why I want to gather everybody. Ramaru said he'd bring everybody here, but... He's missing. He's missing. Did you hear a nya? Yeah, because Jin ends his sentences with either meow or woof. So this is where you were. I forgot about this girl too. Rise and shine, Sarah-senpai. Hurry up and get on with this explanation. You ain't with Ramaru? And what about Kurumada? Is it okay to leave him out? Did he finally die? <gasps> she wrong for that. What's that reaction for? It's just a joke. Hold on. Has nobody gone to check on him? <gasps> he, he's fine, right? Like, he was charging and all. Um, girl, he did. Ain't it obvious? It better not be Ron Maru. <gasps> My guy. My guy. I'm more stubborn than that. Thank goodness, you seriously had us worried. <laughs> Some reception I'm getting. Now we've gathered everybody but Ron Maru and Keiji. Keiji, huh? Wonder where he could be. Nothing for it. Let's get the banquet ready ahead of him. Everybody, assemble in the cemetery. <gasps> oh, I'm scared. Wait, I'm scared. Save, save, save. I know, he ran always little stuff in cagey in a coffin like a turkey. Let's go. Everybody at? All right, everybody prepared? Um, are we starting now? Um, so are we already starting? <gasps> There's no time. Meter is repairing Maple right now. If we don't hurry, he'll finish and... Oh, he's here. Oh, I finished ages ago. Glad I made it in time. <gasps> Midori, how stubborn can a guy be? As if that's anything new. <gasps> it's true. Since years ago, he's... <gasps> oh my gosh, I'm so glad you finally remembered. All the devotion I've put forth. The effort I gave to grant your wishes. I made Reiko an opportunity for a reunion. I gave Kyutaro a body that could keep playing the sport he so loves. Jin is so cute. And to this day, Jin, your mother is healthy and looking after you just as you wished. After him, but he's in the, this game. Oh, what a happy bunch. What about us is happy? We were all tricked by your offers. You took advantage of our feelings for others, our pained emotions, and you stole our happiness, our lives, our futures. Literally, he's like, I'm so happy. I did all of that and gave you counseling. Kana only wished for her sister's happiness and her sister's dead. I see. Which is why you said you wanted your sister's wish granted. Do you know what she put? <gasps> what he's about to say next is about to break my heart. Huh? What's that smile mean? I don't want to want to hear it. We don't need to hear it. Oh, really? Then I guess I'll never tell you. <gasps> but wait. Which is it? I want to know. Oh my god, this is about to be so bad. 
is what she said. Such a good big sister. She said, I want Kana to meet her real family. That wish. Of course, I granted that too, didn't I? I, reunite, I reunited you with someone much like you. Kind, weak, and cowardly. So, Hiyori? <gasps> I knew it. I freaking knew it. What did I tell y'all? I freaking knew it. You remember when I said, you know what? They have the same hairstyle. Like, what if they're a family? I knew it. Your big, bro your big brother by blood. No way. So was Kana's. That means Kana lost not just her sister, but her brother, too. I said it. I called it. I thought as much. As much of a liar as so was. His affection wasn't a lie. He always protected Kana when she couldn't do anything. Can't say it's the first time I've seen this. It's crazy, Bubba. Like, it's crazy. No, even now, when she's about to give in, she sees them. Kind hallucinations of her sister and so. You know what? Well, I'm glad your hallucinations were kind. Mine, like, choked me out. So. Hallucinations? Kana's weak. Surely she shouldn't be looking at them. She should stand firm on her feet. Looking forward, treating everyone as precious. So the two of them can disappear in peace. So that she can say, I'm alright. So I can't give in. I'll never lose to someone like you. Worthless. Why won't you all entertain me? Why won't everyone break down properly? Toys these days sure are complex. Toys? Just then, something flew in from outside the cemetery, and I swear to God, if it's Maple with her spider claws. Ramaru. Ramaru. He was getting worth his ideas, too. Midori took the ID card from Ranmaru. Give it back. Why do you have the ID card? Why? Because he's the villain who knocked out Miss Sarah. Ranmaru betrayed you all. <gasps> that, that's wrong. Sarah. Damn it. I can't be anything after all. So I at least wanted to be Sarah's salvation. I thought... If I put the Joe AI in me, no way. No way. That's why you were using the AI Seaver? How hilarious. To give up even your own consciousness for her. He did what? That's actually crazy. Midori. Yes, yes, I'm tired of talking now. Come on in. Maple has been reborn. No. Oh no, it's over. Do we have to fight her again? Yeah, but she's so cute. I'm scared. Yeah, I'm scared. And hungry. And my head kind of hurts. <gasps> what in the hell? What is going on? What is going on? Draw some blood. I'll try my best. <laughs> Run away, everyone. Ooh, what's even going on here? <gasps> I stuffed some powerful AIs into her. She may look hideous, but I think it's what's on the inside that counts. I'm gonna... S oh, oh my god. Wait, Rio Ranger. I'm gonna slaughter all you bastards together. My, my. So you're my prey? Uh, help me, guys. Yuri. Now go, Maple. Run wild till your battery gives out. Not the chainsaw. She chainsaw, man? Wait, I need to save her battery. Her battery. We gotta fight this thing. Listen, at this point, our only option is to run down her battery. Find a way to make her do things that consume a lot of power. Okay. Okay. Angry AI started up. No mercy for you bastards. I'll kill you. You're dead. He's giving you guys a serious glare. Hey, can I save? If we can stimulate his anger somehow, I'll okay, save game. Okay, so who can make him angry? 
Take the plunge, let him win over. We'll offer them an invitation. Invitation with what? If he's angry, what are you supposed to do? Like, make him angrier? Let's provoke them. Okay, we can make them angrier, I guess. Let's do it. Select a target to use it on. Angry AI. Yes. I am scared. You bastard. You getting cocky? I'll kill you. I'll bludgeon that damn look off your face. Is that going down? Oh, it went down. It worked. He's really simple, huh? Cool. Okay. Sneering AI started up. Oh my, I see Miss Now isn't there. Did you all kill her? <laughs> Don't let him bewilder you, cute Taro. I, I get that, but... He has a deceptive personality. We can't go against him carefully, carelessly. Okay, so who should we... What does anyone else do, anyway? If we're timid, they'll kill us. Let's be intimidating to scare them instead. Mm, okay. What do the rest of them do? The same as us, understanding? No, girl. Fist. Okay. You just want to punch people? Okay. The mood's so tense, let's jokes. Girl, okay, where's he not going at? Let's scare him. Let's scare you. Yes. Isn't she like in middle school? Why is she so creepy? <gasps> what is with that attitude? I'm a teacher, you know. Delinquent students must be given thorough guidance. Ew, creep. Oh, <gasps> yay! Okay. Lecture me when he's trying to kill me. Yeah, try again. <gasps> Maple. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I won't do anything but hurt you. Maple, be strong. You don't want to do this, right? Maple attacked my. <gasps> Ow. She did. Oh, she gone. Mabel doesn't like fighting, but she can't defy Midori's orders. What can I use? Can I use the Kyutaro now? On her? To make her feel better, I guess? Okay. You think of me as an ally? But I can't. I'll hurt all of you. I can't control my movements. Poor girl. We gotta save her somehow. Wait, we're at fifty percent though, which is fine. My sleep back up. Frightened AI. Everyone, please stop. Ooh, I want to use Khan on him just because he knows. Because of the brothers. Big sis Sarah, can't we save that guy, Mia? With them running on the same battery, I don't see any way we can. Okay, I'm gonna use Khan on him. Oh, she's so cute. I know, I don't want to use violence either. But I can't possibly think of anything except for all of us or all of you to die. Okay. Kana, okay, who hasn't gone yet? Q, has Q gone? Angry, you back up, Angry? Wait a second. Hurry up and die. Owie! Wait, can I? Mia, how dare you? Wolf, muscle gorilla, are you okay, Mia? Oh, the nerve. Wait, can I use her on him? Again? <laughs> Will it work? <gasps> it didn't work. Okay, but Q's back up. Okay, so. So last time I used Hinako, so I cannot use Hinako again. So let's use her on him then. Him. Okay, very well. I shall slice off your head to make a decisive end to that impudent talk. Not my head. I need it. Okay, now I feel like there's a secret energy somewhere, and it's with my little man right here. Okay, let's use him. Ready? <gasps> Chainsaw man. Oh, her hand's gone. Maple swinging left hand hit her right hand. My, my hand. I can't watch this, damn it. Right, my little man. Let's go. So I got target. Uh, rearranger. <gasps> He's so cute. Bastard, stop it. <gasps> we killed them. 
I knew I knew he was something. I did it, meow. What? Yori, please release me. Ryo would get so mad if he got splashed on by a little elementary school kid. Like, it's actually crazy. <gasps> Yatar! <sighs> so you were useless after all. Time to scrape this piece of junk. Oh, but that, ain't that your girlfriend? Is that how you talk to an ally? <gasps> Maple loved you, and you just... Thank you, everyone. I've woken up. She up? Oh. Hey, Hiyori. Shall we die together? Oh, how romantic. I know, I bet he woke up and he's like, oh my god, I can't wait to kill all these people. And now he's standing here like... Huh? Let's die, Hiyori. Uh, you die by yourself, I'm good. Oh, no way. Midori. Die. Maybe we're serious. No, oh, I'm surprised. Was that you trembling? <gasps> Look at him trembling. Made the mistake of thinking there was no way she'd resist. She's gonna kill you. Ain't nobody gonna help you. You fine with that, dummies? If I die, your callers will. What do you expect from us? Can't stop her anyhow. <laughs> They're about to Romeo and Juliet this thing. There's nothing left to be done. We just have to watch it end. Home GA. Hiyori, accept it already. Oh, stop this maple. Goodbye. I love you, maple. Maple. He's lying. That's a lie, maple. I know, Hiyori is lying. No, I'm not. I really love you, Maple. <gasps> this is, I know this is such a dirty trick. How dare he play with a girl's feelings? Don't be fooled. I won't believe you, Hiyori. Together. <gasps> no. He actually get her? Wah. No, my bodies. <gasps> no. Wait, it burned one of the coffins. So it doesn't matter that Hayasaka's dead. Haha. -ha. She sure got close. But too bad. I, I wouldn't say that. Hmm? Just now, you were scared. Scared of Mabel's attack she was ready to die for. You showed weakness, your fear of death. That's right, you little freak. I was always thinking about that Midori might be indifferent even to his own death. But I was wrong. Even Midori doesn't want to die. Talk about nonsense. What does knowing that got to do for you? If you see a weakness to take advantage of, just go ahead and try. After all, the only means left to you now is the banquet. The banquet. Feels like we're on our last resort now. Wait, I feel like we're ending like towards the end of the game. Where's Mr. Policeman? Oh, I forgot about Keiji. We got no time to look around. I'm sure he's safe. Um, how about we ask Ronmaru? Right, this is our last chance. Until we're ready, I should talk with everyone. Um, where's Ronmaru? Let's save. Where's my Keiji? Where is he? Where's Jin? Mr. Policeman may be a lady killer, but I'm uneasy without him here, meow. Oh, when I said lady killer, I was like, oh, like you saying that he's like... He's got Riz, but no, he is lady killer, um, like killed a lady. Killed a lady. Okay. Yeah, yeah, okay, let's talk to Ron Moore. He's got some explaining to do. Where, where, where my boy at? What's up? You don't look well. Why are we so being so nice to him? Well, duh. And I mean, it's not like everyone made it okay. Yeah. Um, so, was I useful? Uh, of course. Of course you were. 
Um, Sarah. Okay, she's... Oh. No, uh, I mean... Just, I, I hope you find him. Wait, where did you put him? Yeah. No, no, no. Where did you put him? You almost ready? Sure. Cute to row. I'm ready. Let's go. Alright, I expected no less. Honestly, I'm trembling, Lou. Kyutaro, um... Is there something you haven't told me? I want to know all about what happened when we were acting separately. It's alright. It's all just like I told you. If you won't tell me, then I won't ask. I'm sure I can believe Kyutaro. When you're ready, Sarah, give me a holler, and we'll start preparing for the banquet. Okay, I'll give you a holler. Let's save. Okay. I'm ready. Let's, let's, let's start. Okay. I'm ready. Everyone get inside. I'm sure everybody knows, but now we're gonna have to choose who goes inside the seven coffins. Doesn't matter if they're alive or dead. Someone's gotta go in, human or doll. Feels bad, but I guess we gotta start with the ones we lost. Don't know if it counts as a proper burial, but they are coffins at least. What to do about the rest? All the dummies go in. That'll do, right? What? Don't decide that on your own. Well, why not? If we're just getting in. I know, I, I trust Kyutaro. Oh, Hinako got in. No objections. Okay. Seems stupid to take our sweet time about it. Okay. Okay. Awesome. Anzu forced herself into a coffin. If anything happens, count on me. Okay. One left. Alright, now we'll put the bodies in. I know, Hinako got some courage. Put the dummy's bodies into the coffins. All that's left is that one, Mia. The last coffin. I'll inspect it. I don't want to. I really don't want to. No good, it won't open. We have to think of a way to pry it open, Mia. Okay, but since the banquet isn't starting, does that mean it's empty? <gasps> then, Mr. Policeman really did escape, Mia. Well, then let's discuss who should go in the... What's that noise? Oh, I don't feel safe. <gasps> Wait, everyone's gone. The coffins. They completely buried themselves. No way. The gate! Hurry to the gate! <gasps> it's open. Wait, that means someone was inside. I'm saving. That means someone was inside. Go inside. Oh, this is so sussy. Who are, who are you? Heyo! I've been withering away waiting. What? Where am I? Where in the world is this place? Why, the antechamber for the banquet. Oops, pardon me. I'm Meister, who'll be overseeing proceedings for the banquet. Now, I'm gonna have you select the challenger. <gasps> what are you gonna make us do, Mia? Whoa, now. Can't tell you that yet. The game is Russian roulette. It's a test of luck between the challengers. So, or Midori? Allow me to introduce the other challenger. Midori. Quit it with the theatrics. <gasps> now, which coffin will you pick first? First? These? The challengers will go in these coffins. I did save. I saved right before we went inside. Coffins again? Wow, they're just the same kind that were in the cemetery. No traps here. And they're brand new and unused. <gasps> Lucky you. If you're scared, want me to pick first? Wait, wait. At any rate, let's look them over to make sure there's nothing suspicious. Shall we pick the left one? Sure. Just because he's not standing there. Okay. Let's check them out a little more. He inspected the coffins. No need to put your sticky hands all over them. There's no difference between the two coffins. Seems that way. Nothing suspicious. We'll go with the one Sarah picked. Okay, cool. Okie dokie. Then I'll go in the one you didn't pick. He's in this one. 
This is really the right one. Now for you to decide on a challenger, feel free to take your time thinking it over. Though not so long the dummies run out of battery, of course. Oh no. Who's gonna go in? Okay, let's save. Can I save? <gasps> no. Wait. I'll do it, Mia. No, you won't. Um. No, you won't. Jin? I'll do it. No, I'll do it. I wouldn't recommend that. You're chiming in? I'm offering you a hint, seeing as you have the disadvantage. I'm always the one being protected, Wolf. You're all nice, so you never pick me at times like this, Meow. But if that meant only I survived, I'm sure I'd regret it, Wolf. I'd feel like I was a burden. So I want you to let me do it, Wolf. I want to know if there were people who I saved by being there, Wolf. Uh, you already have, my boy. <laughs> because I love all of you guys. Not the running. Get out. No, 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 dog. Get out. Literally, no. Listen, listen to Meister. L listen to me. Listen to your big sis. Jin. Oh, no. I don't want to rush and... Russian roulette. Now let's move on. It's about time to start. He literally jolted. He, like, jumped. All right, let's go. Oh. Let's go. The moon? We've arrived in quite the place. I don't see any coffins anywhere. Now it's about time. Oh, I'm scared. He looks so creepy. Okay. I'll prepare myself. I'm not going to sacrifice anyone. Okay. Well then, let's begin. Come forth. Who? Russian. <gasps> An amazing machine, isn't it? Coffins. Is everyone in there? He does look like Slender Man's brother. Whoa! Don't try opening them, okay? Cause I've locked the coffins just now. At any rate, I should get closer and inspect them. Okay. Wait, can I not? Oh, there we go. <gasps> the platform rotated. Incredible, huh? Using this machine, you guys gotta locate Midori. L locate Midori? Yep, in one of these nine coffins, whoever hits their target first wins. This is the Russian Roulette Banquet. You mean? Naturally, the challenger dies if they're hit. Oh my god, my little boy. <gasps> then, Jin's life is on the line? Hey, let me out of here. Are you outside, Mia? Big sis, Sarah. Oh, this is not good. This is so sad. He's so little. They're completely soundproofed in there. But as you can see, you can talk via monitors. <gasps> I can't see anything from here, Meow. If only I'd known, <laughs> I would've gone in there. Don't get it twisted. Huh? We're the ones who can probably observe the situation from out here. That's right. What's important is winning and surviving. I'll win and save Jin. Oh, and by the way, it's a team battle. So Midori needs a put button pusher too. Never trust a man in a suit? Okay, but hear me out. Hear me out. If you, like, cover up his head... Look, hold on. Hear me out. If you cover up his head... Here, look. If you cover up his head... I'm just using my little overlay thing. Cover up his head. Yeah? Yeah? Am I being heard out? Yeah? Meaning I'll push the buttons in instead. You ain't gonna cheat. My cheating is Midori's cheating. We'll share responsibility. You better not cheat yourselves. Rule breakers get death. As if we even could. Well then, once we decide the turn order, we can get started. I'd say it's fine for Team Jin to go first, having the disadvantage. And it'll get Saffle in, please. Please. All right. Went a little too long, huh? Let's start already. Wait, I wanna save. Where's number one? Hey, you dead. An extremely heavy hair dominates his face. 
From what we heard, the rules are simple. Nine coffins. If Jin is picked, we lose. If Midori is hit, we win. But... Is it really that simple? Above all, it's strange that Midori, sh who should be in a coffin, isn't saying anything. But... It doesn't change what we have to do. We'll discuss it together and find an answer. <gasps> okay! By the way, you can rotate coffins during your discussion if you want. Okay. Can I save? Save game. Okay. I'm gonna save. Um, I need to look at my schedule. Let's see. Hold on. So I have been studying a lot, like hardcore a lot. Today I went over like six practice tests. So, um, I kind of want to stream this. Let's see. I can't do Tuesday. I'm thinking in my head. I'm thinking out loud. I want to stream this Thursday. Am I doing anything Friday? Oh my God. I have mock interviews that Friday. Should I do it that Friday? I know him saying anything is like so not, uh, it's, it's so sus. It's so sus. I just don't know how much more of this I have. Maybe this is the last one, but I'm my throat hurts. <laughs> I haven't streamed in so long, and to pick it back up with them, and my eyes itch with um a visual novel. I kind of want to keep going with Thirteen Sentinels next week too, so I might do both, and just those will just be the two streams for the week. Is there more streams this weekend? Um, sadly, not tomorrow because I have church at eight p.m. Um. Sundays I don't really like to stream because I have 8 a.m. clinic the next day. Um, I'm thinking I'll stream Friday, Saturday of next week. Your turn to die and then 13 Sentinels because then my clinical boards or like my written boards, my written boards is that next Tuesday. So I'm thinking. I'm trying to make sure, okay, maybe I shouldn't stream Saturday if my boards are coming up. I don't know yet. I don't know. I'm not doing anything Sunday. If I, like, start early Sunday, then I could still go to bed on time. And then I'll be okay sleeping Monday. I might actually, let me do it right now, actually. Well, we're listening to this BGM. I'm about to just make a waiting room for Sunday to continue with your turn to die. Um, hold on. I'm about to do it right now before I forget because I'm going to forget. Yeah, because I'm thinking, I'm like, my, my, my clinical or my written boards is in 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 days. It's in 11 days. And if I stream, um, today's at 12. So if I do 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. I don't know. Should I do 18, 19? I don't know. It's so hard, like, juggling this because I I need to study a little bit more. Um, Because all I need to do, all I need to make is a 75 overall. I need to make a 75 overall so I can pass. Um, But... It's like the test is so huge that you don't know how much you're. Does that make sense? Like you don't know how much you studied to like pass. I don't know, and I and I just want to stream. Uh, I don't know. I'm going crazy. School literally drives me crazy. Like I feel like I went insane this week. Like it was just it was just so bad. It was just so crazy. Yeah, it's just so huge. $500 test, I have to pass on the first try. If I don't, I'm actually gonna die. Um, yeah, I'm not about to pay another 500. I didn't even have that to begin with. <laughs> it's so crazy. Okay, I'm thinking. Um, I, I'll, I'll think about it. There may be a stream Sunday. I may continue your turn to die Sunday. Um, or I'll just wait until next Friday. Is today Friday? Until next Friday. But, yeah. I didn't get to show off my new BRB screen though. Look. Isn't that cute? I made that myself. I'm a graphic design god. Sometimes we all get a little crazy things. I know, my schedule is so crazy. But I hate not streaming. I like to play, I like to be on here. 
Oh, pretty. <laughs> Thank you. I have my chatting screen, but I can't show it yet because it is. I actually plays along with my um, what's it called? A new outfit. Uh, the BRB screen kind of plays along with it too, but I'm probably gonna use that more in the future anyway. So I already have it loaded in. Okay. Well, we'll see. I think I think I will stream Sunday. Um, I'll make the waiting room. I think I will because I don't have anything going on. So I, I have all day tomorrow to study. I have all morning and afternoon Sunday to study. So I think I need a break. We had a volunteer thing this morning and I decided last minute that I'm not showing up because, and I, and I went to clinic tomorrow, this morning and I told my teacher, to well, one of them, well, one that's nice. I told a nice teacher. I was like, she was like, so how was the volunteer event? And I was like, oh, I didn't go. Um, and she was like, how come? And I was like, I think if I had went, I probably would have had a mental breakdown there and then started crying. And then all the patients would have probably thought that I was insane. So there we go. There we go. Um, good night. <laughs> This is so funny. I'll be I'll be more online after April twenty third. I already have my schedule figured out for that week, but um, I'll be more online. I'm more on Twitter, even though I post like every two four days. <sighs> okay. Good night, everyone. Thanks for joining. No one died. Thank God. I didn't die. Y'all didn't die. No one died, which is good. Have a good night. I'm gonna go eat some flan now, because my grandpa was calling my name earlier. Okay. Good night. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't die. <laughs>